everyone, welcome to Fiasco Knots for November. I am pleased to be joined by the following individuals: Kyle Bosman, Hello. Ben Moore, hi, D- uh, Michael Damiani. Hey, yeah. Sometimes I forget that hey, you have a first name, <laughs> and I'm like I Michael Damiani. Too. Yeah, uh, and myself. Hey, yeah. Uh, anyway, this time we're gonna do a set that is from the the OG, second OG Fiasco Companion. Back in the day, we did this set back at Game Trailers, but we thought it'd be fun to give it another whack. Fiasco High, high school, baby. I don't remember a day of Game Trailers. Me neither, actually, kind of. Really, Kyle? <laughs> yeah. That's because that's they wiped your memory. Yeah, they wiped your yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. they memory. They did the Men in Black thing. <laughs> Venus. G- weather balloon. Gas over Venus. Whatever. Um, now the Polygon's doing Final Bossmans. We don't have to worry about it. Yeah. <laughs> uh, what <laughs> relationships? Oh no! I mean, we got to read like what the high school thing's all about. Oh sure, it's on like a previous page. Oh weird. Okay, fiasco high. High school is often tragically billed as the best years of your life. Yet, is there any other time in life so aptly summarized as powerful ambition and poor pulse in control? Poor impulse control. Uh, Can't control that pulse. <laughs> pulse in control. Um, uh, this play set is tailor made for the softer package, including in this book. Included in this book, but it works just as well when you play black hearted hardball. Inspirations include films like Ten Things I Hate About You. Love it. Brick. Love it. Sixteen Candles. The mm. Breakfast Club. And mm. Rushmore. Love it. The stunt <laughs> dice rolls work especially <laughs> well for this playset, giving the teen angst an outlet in overly dramatic confessional scenes. Note that there are many potential student-teacher relationships. If you choose these points, it leads play in a particular direction and requires care in establishing personal connections. Avoid them for a straight-up teen game. <laughs> I love this voice. <laughs> oh, I, I'm mad I read that. Like, I... I this is like the worst description of a playset yet, you know? Hey, well, it's because the Fiasco Companion book was like introducing some new rules like the soft tilt and soft aftermath and stuff. Can I have dice. that yeah. uh, tailor made for the soft package, please? <laughs> Be careful. You'll have to establish true relations. Okay, so our relationship. Oh, roll those die. Oh, right. S- Gotta roll Thank them. <laughs> okay, roll into the dice. Set? Sorry, it's just speaking to me. Wait. <laughs> We Wait, we're changing. We're we playing. Play 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 <laughs> Which for one? ten minutes before the we start. <laughs> I just, I just now. imagined like a uh, like a Look, kaiju playset. After Act One, we'll, tra- we'll change to, to yeah, a different playset. If there was a kaiju be... playset, we'd have played it already. Oh, yeah, three times. We would have played it eight times. Can we just make our own playset? Yeah, <laughs> people do and send it to us. Tweet Ian Hink at Twitter. John said Twitter. he had an idea once, didn't he? I'm like, John's just make it. Really? Come on. Wow. Come on. What a roll. C- okay. C- come on. No, no ones. No ones. Okay. Oh. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven twos. <laughs> That's a first. <laughs> That's the worst we've ever done. Four threes, one four, one five, and three sixes. Let's hope twos are good. Well, two is BFFs for relationships, so mm, I'll okay. easily claim that one. Uh, We're all BFFs. Uh, Ian, you and I are BFFs. Just like in real life. Just like in real life. <laughs> So, yeah, I'm writing down relationships. We, we could all be BFF. BFFs. That'd be funny. Burn all our twos. Yeah. And just have BFFs across the board. All right. So we have no ones. <laughs> the whole thing is two. about who's the best best friend. Yeah. All this become um, I'm going to choose yeah. the devil and me for a relationship between Damiani and myself. The devil? What is me? that? The devil and me. So the top, options top with top category. Yeah, top card. So okay, there's so three. It's a three. Yep. There are options within that: athletic rivals, villain and crusader, social rivals, bully and victim, <laughs> bully and victim, yeah. academic rivals, authority figure, and ne'er do well. So right, right, those those are uh, just right. Relationship: the devil and me on the, the you and Damiani card, and I gave you the three already. Alright. So yeah, top and category. No ones. Jeez, that's. Terrible. What was one? Chained, Chained for, for life. life what yeah. does that mean? <laughs> you want to hear those real quick? No? Sure, why not? Brother and sister, or brothers or sisters, cousins, identical twins. You don't think you're related, but you totally are. <laughs> Teacher and student who are also parent and stepchild. Wow. Oh. Uh, same faith, same culture, same immigrant parents, same problems. Dibs. So, siblings. <laughs> All right. Let's see. All right. We can't do any of those. Yeah. So just accept it. 
I don't want to hear about it in the comments. I got a dry arm. I was in the Midwest. I hope that's the only thing people comment. I got dry arms all day. It's real dry in the Midwest. East Coast, West Coast, middle of the country. I got dry right. arms. <laughs> Down here in Arizona, dry <laughs> arms all over the place. We, have, we just have one five, so we can do trouble. Burn it. Yeah. Who's trouble, Damiani? Trouble can either be a drug dealer and best customer, pair of creepy outcasts, that doesn't yes. sound like trouble. angry nerds, business. Christian zealot and soul in need of salvation, undercover cop and the one who knows, and privileged uh, plutocrats. So what I love about this is a uh, second time I heard plutocrats. Today. Yeah, they love plutocrats. Uh, uh, what I love about that is that you can easily burn a two for the weirdos, and so I think that's a good two opportunity. Okay. Because we're so looking to burn two. This twos, is a basically. five? Yeah. yeah. So who do you want uh, to be trouble? Uh, Bossman and Ben, or you and myself? Uh, Ian and me. Sick. Alright, so right, relationship trouble. Story of my life. Trouble. Uh, okay, so... I don't think you're worth the trouble. trouble. All right, so the the one, the two categories we could do that we haven't looked at yet are slaves to the man, which are like jobs, and uh, senior superlatives, um, which all are one kind of kid and some kind of minion. So coolest kid in school and fawning minion, smartest kid in school and ambitious minion, strongest kid and cringing minion, meanest kid and sadistic minion, weirdest kid and weirder minion, Richest kid and devious minion. You know what I love about cringing minion is it's you know the old definition of just so you're physically just right. Like, the, he's strong I hate and I'm the cringing. new internet and, definition of and cringe. And so I love this idea of it's just someone who's always just like oh, I'm cringing. <laughs> you're making me cringe. I don't want us to do that one. <laughs> Your video is not funny. It's making me cringe. Yeah. I cringe when people use the word cringe. Yeah, now I, I do want that. Oh, cringers, dude. Cringers, cringers are the worst. It's like, go to school. I'm uncomfortable. You're making me cringe. <laughs> That's what you all sound like. Yep. I, too, hate those people. Um, let's do <clears throat> BFFs. <laughs> <laughs> you were doubling down on BFFs? Sure. Hello, all right, audience. Cool. All right, so that's me and Ben are BFFs. Okay. Ooh, I like this. I really <laughs> want Damiani and I to be academic rivals. <laughs> And then I want to talk about it with Kyle. Is that... Oops, I capitalized that Fs. That is Fs. that in here? <laughs> yeah, oh, the yeah. devil and me, academic. Oh, yeah, yeah. Uh, uh, well, there are no fives. <laughs> so I'm, I'm, I'm going to burn that two that I wanted to oh, burn for... Uh, uh, trouble? Yeah, for trouble. Pair oh. of creepy outcasts, Damiani. <laughs> okay. Easy. Yep. <laughs> Creepy. No problem. Creepy outcast, though, <laughs> yeah. makes it really fun. <laughs> <laughs> I'm a Wicca and a hacker. What? How would we? <laughs> how would we do this? What do you got? So, uh, number three under BFFs, friends by imperial mandate. Oh, like the cool girl said, you guys have to be friends, right? Is that what that means? I was kind of uh, interpreting it just like, uh, like. Mm, or like the, the principal makes you? Yeah, like one of them's a new kid, and they were like, yeah. make friends with her. Yeah. Mm. She doesn't know anyone. Mm hmm. Yeah. Or the school has an emperor, and we're in some kind of like anime school. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> or Chinese school. I think they I'm all gonna, have emperors. I'm gonna fill in our relationship. <laughs> Do we have social credit? Kyle. Yes. And we're, we're gonna be secret friends. Ooh, Ooh. I love secret friends. Secret friends are good. We, I, I remember see, having secret friends before. That's a good one. I like that one. All right. What do we... Uh... All right. So we don't have any ones or fives. Uh, our relationship is filled out. Yeah. Our Kyle and my BFFs needs filling. Mm -hmm. And the devil and me. Okay. And we got two, three, four, out. six. So we really should use some twos. Oh, yes. BFFs. Let's use a two. Frenemies. Yeah. So that's me and, and Kylie. Yep. Okay, frenemies. But we're BFFs! Yeah! That's a contradiction of BFF! Frenemies! Oh, oh. you just... You, <laughs> uh, <laughs> come on. Just like real life, Kyle. Yeah. Have you ever used the term frenemy sincerely in your life? No. I don't know. Can't say I have. Can't I say know. I have. I don't keep track of the things I say and do, you know? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Best way to live! Best way to live! <laughs> 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 GT! I don't read the mail! <laughs> <laughs> I don't read the mail! I don't. That's how my insurance got canceled. Uh, okay. Same. 
Dude, you just, you get, come on, guys. Because your, your car insurance sends you like a thing like every two weeks. You're like, I'm so used to ignoring yeah, these. And yeah. then suddenly it's the one that I missed was like, hey, dude, you changed your credit card. You got to pay. And I was like, totally. Oh, yeah. Same. Mine was just like Anthem whatever was like in January, apparently just like your plan ceased to exist. And and, and like there was one letter do that. in like a thousand pointless letter. Like I was paperless. I was getting letters every day that was just like. You paid your bill. Yeah, exactly. And I was like, go to hell. Stop sending me letters. Mm-hmm. I'm paperless. And so I stopped reading them. Yeah. And the one it important one. It is weird. One. I feel like I've selected paperless for everything. Yep. And all of those places yep. still send me. Yep. Yeah. Yep. It's fucking irritating. All right. The devil and me. <laughs> we got two, three, four, and six. So two is villain and crusader. Three is social rivals. Four is bully and victim. Sadly, five was academic rivals. Oh, no. I'm sorry. Yeah. Uh, I wanted that one. Although, technically, I guess we could skip everything and then use that for our wild, but... It's risky play. You can be academic rivals and one of these other things, you know? Like well, villain, what's number six? Uh, six is authority figure and ne'er-do-well. I kind of don't want any of us to be adults. But oh, no way. Yeah. yeah. I don't. Kids rule, adults drool. How about social rivals? That's sort of that could that be was, academic. That was the other one I was. Contemplating. That could be yeah. That yeah, could they're be like academic. in clubs and stuff. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. We'll agree to interpret that as academic. Uh, okay, rivals. social. Rivals. In fact, it's even more juicy because your academic rivals and everything else rivals too. All right, we're frenemies, Kyle. I gotta write social that down. Social. All right. Rivals. Ian, I think you pushed the two sixes over there as well. I think we. I think those two sixes are still in oh, play. Oh yeah. Good oh. eyes, thank you. So now we're looking at <clears throat> needs, locations, and objects. Of course, we try to establish needs first. Right. Uh, and we should look. have two needs spaced out. So everybody ends up with a need. I, I want to specify the social rivals a little more. So you're going to have a need. Um, we have two, three, four, and six left. Okay, so I'm looking at to get out of... To get revenge, to get respect, to get away. I want to. Get so uh, out. I'm gonna do uh, a. <laughs> uh, to get out of. Let's do it. Let's burn another two. So the uh, social rivals need to get out of. Make Damiani write that down. <coughs> to get out of. Need to get out of. All right. So detention, which we can't do. Uh, date to the prom. You don't have to fill that out right now if you don't want to either. Uh, what you are could my do, options? You could do another need for Kyle and myself, or you could give um, an object or a location to the, either the Ian Damiani pairing or the Ben-Kyle pairing. That way everyone has a need. And another thing. Hmm... Or you can hmm. fill out the subcategory if you want. Up to you. I'm just saying you don't have to. I'm going to say the need for between you guys, between Ian and Kyle, is to oh. get revenge, which Ooh. is three. Need to get revenge. We are frenemies. We're frenemies. Oh, so maybe that's what bonds us together. Yeah. Did we put a third dice? Or is it right there? Uh, I think it's the one by Ben's drink. Okay. Yeah. yeah. All right. So we need. As long as they're just not here, it's fine. Right. It doesn't really matter. We need a they're. need and. We have needs taken care of. Well, we have. So now fill we're doing in. locations and objects. You can do a location and object, or a location or an object for you and myself, or a location or object for Ben and Kyle, or you can fill in the needs for me and Bossman or you and Ben. Okay. Let's do. Well, we got two, two, three, four, six. Objects are usually pretty juicy, too. Oh. Eh. I want to get away. I want to <laughs> run away. Right. So, uh, let's do the location. Uh, let's do location for us. Okay. Okay. And uh, I'm going to use uh, the last four. The final four. And it'll be around town. Okay. So the so right location around town. A pair okay. of creepy outcasts 
hang about around town. Around town. Okay. Um, I like the objects. I'm gonna look at objects here, and then we can start filling stuff in. So what do we have here? Two, three, six. Two is dramatic. Three is dangerous, and six is romantic. Uh, you, should I? You want me to read through all those? You guys? No. Okay. I kind of like our pace. We're not we're like, sure, you know what sure. I mean? We're not uh, dwelling uh, on any of these Then I, I won't even read them myself, and I'll just give you two a dramatic Ooh. object. Okay. Don't know what they are, mm -hmm. <laughs> but they're going to be dramatic. Ben, can you write that one in? Yes. Cool. So say object dramatic. Oh. Objecta dramatica. <laughs> Objectica dramaticus. I, I watched the first episode of that show, The Alienist, that tweeted at me once. <laughs> on the plane the other day, yesterday. It was actually pretty cool. <laughs> so far, I guess. Ian, I'm really sorry about this. Oh. Hey. We need to get revenge by seducing a teacher. That's going to be a sin. Don't be sorry, baby. All right, that was my whole fun. seventh I grade. That's very fun. <laughs> You too young. I went too young. That was my whole twelfth grade. There we go. <laughs> I don't know. I don't understand math. Yeah, six goes to Ian. We're very young. <laughs> I don't understand numbers. I'm sorry. All right. Not my intention. Three left. Need to get revenge Ooh. by seducing a. Uh, our dramatic object, Kyle, mm -hmm. is a gorilla suit. Ooh. Hell yeah. What number is that? Two. Yes. Three and six. Alright. So who needs what again? Uh so uh you and Ben need a to get out of need okay. and we, you that need was to the fill only thing I saw are around town. <laughs> <laughs> Gorillas. So is that the mascot of the school we need then? A, a need gorilla? To get out of. Or it's a prop that the school inherited from the movie Trading Places so. starring uh Dan Aykroyd and Eddie Murphy. Is there All a gorilla right. suit in that? Yeah. Who yeah. wears it? On a you Beaks. What? We use our last six. Okay. So our need is to to get out of, uh, I was, I was sold on it for a second because it would be your reputation, but I don't know. To get, get out of what? Wait, our need is to get out of. Yeah. Yeah. So okay. I have to this pick one. This is you of, and Ben. Yeah, yeah it's got to be a, a, yeah. a three or six. What do you so got? So I was thinking your reputation because, but then Apple Valley After School Jesus Fellowship. That's pretty funny. Whoa, Whoa, that's we're pretty going funny. with that. We're going with Whoa. that. To get out of the fellowship? Uh, yes. Yeah. The, the religious after, fellowship. So it's it's called the Apple Apple Valley After School Jesus Fellowship. What is an after school fellowship? It's a thing. It's like Sunday school every day after school. It's probably like you go to like, yeah. Holy moly. Every which, day? Which is not a good time. <laughs> It could be if you got friends in there. I suppose if you believe in things, oh, it man, could this, be nice. This creepy outcasting is going to be perfect for that. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah, but that's the last thing we got to figure out is around town. Oh, yeah, right? I'm going to call yeah. you God Kid or something like that. Because so, you're like religious, apparently. Yeah. Okay. Uh, you, so right now, Ian, with the last choice, gets any option. I get any option. We don't have to use the six. We yeah, can use the six is random. So, but under uh, uh, object dramatic. No. Wait, what is it? It's uh, oh, that location thing, around, around town. town. Right, right, right. Okay, so location around town. I am gonna read. Actually, it's good to read through all the locations, but I'll read around town first. Um, oh, uh, Promise Hill Country Club, Rich Kids Mansion on the Promise Hill Fairway, mm. Poor Kids Trailer in Redbud Court, mm. Homewood Branch Library, Chicken Hut, oh. Breed Love Correctional Facility. Woof. <laughs> These are all pretty crazy. That's the name of our town is Breedlove? Uh, I think Apple Valley is the county, at least. Sure. And Breedlove could be... Well, Breedlove could be a name. Named after somebody. Yeah, it could be a name. Got it. Like... Breedlove. Candace Breedlove Correctional Facility. Um, uh, I feel like Chicken Hut sounds familiar. We might have done Chicken Hut before. Uh, what? what? Chicken, chicken Hut? Also, chicken I don't want hut. us to have a job. I think we did That's Chicken Hut in the West. <laughs> you know, like, yeah, I, I yeah. feel like we have done Chicken Huts before. Chicken Taco Huts. Breaking into a poor kid's trailer in Redbud Court seems interesting. And you don't necessarily have to break we in. We don't have that to break could, in, but... That could be one of your trailers. Yeah. Should we do that? Or should we do Rich Kid Mansion on Promise Hill Fairway? Anything jumping out to anybody? Or the correctional facility? No, nah, like, like, use your relationship. Use the fact that you're a pair of creepy teens. Right. 
So I feel like being extremely rich or being very poor is a good inroad for being a creepy teen. Be really rich. Okay. I agree. I, Let's I do rich punch kids. Up. Rich kids mansion. Punch up. I love that, Damiani. Punch up. <laughs> so rich kids mansion on the Promise Hill Fairway. Yeah. Oh man. That's really making me want to be like a Promised super rich goth kid. Hills Fairway. Promise Hill Fairway. Oh, singular. Whatever, doesn't matter. Cool, we're by a golf club. Yeah. Is that what a fairway is? Yeah. It's That's what. Yeah. Nice area of the. Yeah. The holier on that you're you want to be on. You want to drive onto the fairway. Oh, here, Ben, put that one back rough. between you and Damiani, just so we don't get confused. Not confused. I was getting confused. That's fine. Um, slide those dice back over here if you don't mind. Slide well, actually, here, make a collection dice. for you. And oh, yeah, we need some over here Good so call. to knock over there for them. Yep. All right, four and four, or eight and eight, whatever. I think I know my character's name already. Yeah, so uh, let's run through what we're, what we're squicking at here All right. so far. So Ian and I are, are BFFs. However, that relationship is defined that we are fre frenemies. Frenemies. Uh, together we share a need to get revenge by seducing a teacher. <laughs> <laughs> it's a complex relationship. Mm -hmm. I believe us. We're up to the task. Ben, who are you and Kyle? We're secret friends. BFFs. Uh, our dramatic object is a gorilla suit. Beautiful. Yep. Damiani, who are you and Ben? We are the devil and me, social rivals. And we have a need. We need to uh, get out of Apple Valley After School Jesus Fellowship. <laughs> That's the most exciting it's thing. so specific and Social weird. Social rivals trying to get out of religious school. Um, and uh, Damiani and myself have a trouble relationship. We are a pair of creepy outcasts. <laughs> and our location is around town. Rich Kids Mansion on the... Uh, what does that say? Pro Promised Hill Promised Fairway. Promised Hill Fairway. Yeah. <laughs> So that's kind of funny because, yeah. like, a hill is not a fairway. It's there could be a... That's not funny. Welcome to Facts with Fiasco. <laughs> <laughs> Facts Asco Nuts. Don't let your insurance expire. Check your mail today. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, read those letters, kids. Uh, fucking politics. Um, okay. So did you get a new plan? I got... Yeah. Well, I got a weird... Six months after it happened when I found out I had no insurance, right, I got some bizarre ass... Doctor, yeah. Right. I got some bizarre ass, like, stopgap plan because it wasn't open enrollment, so I just couldn't get a new plan. But now I've got, I'm, I'm paying double what I used to pay, and it'll activate in January for Blue Shield of California. Hey, Blue Shield, Can, no, we, can we just do an easy update where we get all nine Alice together and we talk about our insurance plans? <laughs> <laughs> insurance plans? You know what's weird is I think a lot of people would appreciate it. Yeah, it'd be, be so boring. <laughs> how, to, how to adult. Yeah. The easy update guide to being an adult. Here's what we've learned, because we all do it poorly. Um, it's actually kind of a fun idea. Um, okay, so... Also, this doesn't necessarily mean that either one of us is the rich kid, I realize. Like, it could be a friend of ours or something. NPC, but, yeah. But, yeah, I mean, or it's just easier if one of us is filthy rich. Could be a cringy frenemy. <laughs> God damn it. Uh, one of us is Elon Musk's kid. Elon Musk <laughs> and Grimes' daughter. <laughs> that man does not have a child. Yet. Okay. Uh, he made the child. <laughs> one of us is Elon Musk's Tesla robot daughter. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's too weird. I love it. Okay. Hey, want to vape? <laughs> <laughs> hey, want to vape? Oh, my camera fell over. That's fun. Um, mm. Never trusted those skinny tripods. Uh, that one's just weird because the gravity. That um, oh man, yeah, I need to weird. turn that into a character. Elon Musk's vaping daughter is too good. We'll make a Wait, are you going to do it. that one? Oh, just in real life. Just in, yeah. I was seriously considering the robot daughter thing for a hot minute, but it's too complex. <clears throat> We're playing it cool. No aliens, no robots. No. Soft till. Yeah, it's a soft till. No powers. No powers. <laughs> no government conspiracies. No Aztec ruins. <laughs> I can't promise a thing. <laughs> I can't promise. Cthulhu's showing up in Act yep. 2. Yeah. Um, all right. The Anybody eyes. have any, like, ideas? Yeah, my character's <laughs> name is Elias Whipple. Wow. Look at you. He, uh, he wears, uh, button-up shirts and vests over them. <laughs> so wait, are we all creepy outcasts? 
No, he's not an outcast. <laughs> no. I just, I just, I'm presuming we're at a kind of nice high school. Seems, seems like it. Yeah. He's the kid who's so cool that he makes the vest cool. Oh, I don't know if he's cool, Elias Whipple. Oh. We'll figure that out. <laughs> we'll figure it out. Were any of you cool in high school? Yeah, I was. Sick, me too. <laughs> the coolest. Um, yeah. <laughs> everybody voted everybody most likely to me. make something of their life. Um. <laughs> Ew. Like only one person would make it. Like most likely, yeah. if anyone is going like, to do it, yeah, it's yeah, gonna yeah. Be there's like yeah, there's these two. Most, first person most likely to make it out. Like, yeah. They had that. Like. Yeah, I think I got like most most likely to like live off their parents or something like weird like that. Brutal. Yeah, which is funny because it's not like I've been working since I was like 14, so whatever. Uh, my yearbook had class clown and class funniest, and I got class clown. <laughs> nice. That is a brutal distinction. That is a, yeah. <laughs> oh, <laughs> baby. <laughs> All right. Wow, that's so good. Yeah. Oh. That other guy is funnier. <laughs> Was he? Yeah. Was it the polygon guy? Yep. Went to school with that guy. <laughs> Can you throw me the fatty there? Yeah. Um, my character's name is Jason Futz. Uh, I love that man. Yeah, he he always wears a Letterman jacket. He is always chewing gum. Uh, he is the the captain of the football team. He oh. is, is a very high standing. However, he hates all of this. Uh, it is just a front. Uh, his obsession is Pokemon cards, <laughs> and uh, he tries to have these clandestine meetings with with other people in high school to to trade. Pokemon cards. He's after a very specific card, and is like the Elias only thing. Whipple, perhaps. Yeah, we're secret friends. Okay, that he secret actually friends. cares about. Okay, I like that. Good setup. Good. Sorry, setup. what is the card he only cares about? I, for some reason, it just popped into my head. I don't know why he cares about it. He really wants a, a holographic Polyrath. Okay, I don't know why. <laughs> Doesn't even. That's just what he wants. <laughs> I like it. Okay. Man, I can't I think. Know. I can't think of anything. What, do you got what year there? is it? Yeah. This year. It's 2000. Oh, 2018. Yeah. Okay. I'm going to be Chris Townsend. <laughs> Great name. And uh, right on this side, too. Oh, for us, side. the other for side is for us. us. For us. Oh, that is a great name. And, and what? Sorry, I cut you off. So, uh, I am a teenager who pretty much their their mom is obsessed with uh, their image and their reputation. So mm. it's going to go with this like social rival thing. Yeah. So I I am constantly under the the pressure of my mom telling me you got to wear your hairstyle like this. You got to wear these types of clothes to fit in and be popular with the kids and stuff. This is also going to go with the uh, whole getting out of this uh, Jesus fellowship thing. Like, you got to look very presentable and stuff. So, you know, it's either a collared shirt, polo shirt, basically a button down shirt, something like that. Shirt always tucked in um, when I leave the house. But uh, secretly, when I get to school, that all comes undone and stuff. It's just like. Sorry, not going to do that at all. Ooh, nice. Then that's where the creepy outcast is going to come in because while the parents are trying to, like, you have this nice, neat presentation, I, I don't conform to that. And it's kind of like a blemish on the on the, on the family's, like, standing in the town because everyone wants, you know, oh, he needs to be, like, a good, you know, Christian boy and stuff, but not acting like that. Like, I'm rocking, like, when I go to my little, like, after-school Christian thing, on my name tag, I write Metallica on there for my interest, while everyone else is writing like singing Kumbaya. Nobody oh. writes singing Kumbaya. Hey, yes, and they do. Everybody <laughs> writes. Everybody writes Kumbaya. Yeah. Sure. Yeah. Um, and so all the kids are just like, "Why can't you just be normal and stuff, man? Like, what's yeah. this Metallica? Do you worship the devil? Like, they're like that. Like, yeah. So that's why I'm such an outcast and stuff. Okay, so you're you're an outcast, but only from that group. Well, we might see. There might be more to it. Okay, that's you're, just the very from the Apple like the Jesus Fellowship. I can work yes. with this very well. Well, I mean, I imagine that being an outcast from that fellowship would, and maybe just being in it would make you an outcast from other people. 
judging by my own town, there was like a super religious school well, basically the, thing, I'm and everyone was always like, "Who are Everyone you? wants me to be not like, there's anything wrong good with Christian, it, but I'm like, nah, I'm not down with that. Okay, okay. My name is Fiona, Fiona Apple Day Billings. <laughs> is that your given name? My mother named me after Fiona Apple. Great. Yes, cool. Um, <laughs> and it's a hyphenate last out. name, Day yeah. Billings. Hmm. Um, yeah. Fiona Apple, huh? Uh huh. Nice. <laughs> and I am. Elon Musk's robot daughter. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah, funny story though. I hate Fiona Apple. Really? My character. Oh, that makes I sense. love Fiona Apple. Right, right. But Ian loves Fiona Apple. If your mom named you Fiona right. Apple, it's right. bound to happen. Right. Yeah. Like, I'm like, I'm not listening to that sad, angry lady music, or whatever mm-hmm. a kid would say. Um, yeah, and I'm an outcast, and I need to get revenge by seducing a teacher. <laughs> With my friend of me, Elias Whipple, who loves Pokemon apparently and vests. Yes, <laughs> uh, a lip piercing. I decided as well. Uh, Elias Dope. Elias Whipple loves YouTube videos. <laughs> mm. Does he want to be a yeah. YouTuber? I don't know. I, I'm thinking about like what a high school student today is right, like. 2018. And I know you love YouTube videos. Does, does Elias <laughs> Whipple say cringe? Is that part of his vocabulary? I probably. Yeah, I think Elias Whipple might might Do say you cringe. Also carry a cell phone. <laughs> yes. <laughs> And you like YouTube Do you have the videos? Samsung Note 9? <laughs> yes. Elias Whipple has the Samsung Note 9. So wait, am I the rich kid or are you the rich kid? You can both be rich kids. Oh, yeah. You have, you have, a, you have a hyphenate last name. I imagined because of the hyphenate last name and my mom naming me after Fiona Apple, I would be a rich kid, maybe. Yep. <laughs> but Fiona, Day, Fiona Apple Day Billings, I don't know how you <laughs> aren't a rich kid. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> My name is Fiona Apple Day Billings. I am poor. <laughs> I have a vague feeling like we've offended like eight different sections of the audience already with this fiasco nuts, but I'm not sure why. That's how you get them interested. That's how you I'm keep just saying with like a fictional character. No, yeah, no, no, I know. We know no. you you cringers love that YouTube. No, no offense to anyone actually named Fiona Apple Day Billings. Yes. Not my intention. Not intended. Yeah. All cre- all characters are fictional and it's intentional if they are not. Um, okay. So we can figure out the rest as we begin. Shall we just jump right in? Let's top right in. Yeah. Oh wait, I forgot to read all the locations. We'll make it up. It's we'll a high school it's in a high town. School. There's probably an Applebee's. Of course. My high school didn't have an Applebee's. What are you talking about? Nobody's high school has an Applebee's, but the town has an Applebee's. Applebee's in your cafeteria? (laughs) No. (laughs) Presented by Applebee's. This Applebee's like obnoxiously states over and over again that it is the best reviewed Applebee's on Yelp in the county. In Apple Valley County. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. Apple Valley County. I really, I'm loving the idea that our school, because it's 2018, is like everything is sponsored. So, like, the cafeteria is brought to you by uh, Applebee's and General Electric. It's like the Epcot, like, Illuminations show. It's brought to you by General Electric the and Applebee's Siemens. Memorial Cafeteria. <laughs> <laughs> Memorial Cafeteria. General Electric Memorial Cafeteria is very funny. <laughs> That's so good. All right. All right. We're going to begin our high school fiasco right after this pointless intro. Welcome to Fiasco Knots Act 1. What's going on, Elias Whipple? Uh, it is the end of AP English. Uh, <laughs> Elias Whipple and Fiona Apple Day something. Billings. You covered it with those dice. There we go. F- Fiona Apple Day Billings. Uh, both got B minuses on their recent essays. Ugh. Uh... And both seem to be crushed. Like, the bell has rung. People have walked out. But they're both sitting there. Stewing. Sweating. Looking at this B-, minus, wondering how this could possibly be. Because they both fancy themselves good writers. Mm. Maybe the first essay they've had a B on since middle school, you know? Uh, And so we open there. What are you still doing here? Nothing. I... 
I was just reviewing my work. What'd you get? What did you get? B plus. Me too. <laughs> <laughs> Which is terrible. Yeah. You got a B plus? Yes. Frick. What? I got a I got B minus. <sighs> so did I. I just didn't want you to think I was a fucking idiot. I wrote this I wrote this about my dad. You know? So like how does <laughs> Really? How's she gonna give me how's she how's she gonna give me a B minus when I wrote this about my dad? Yeah. I wrote this about my uncle, who like you know, invented some car. It's not the same. Well, he died. <laughs> It's not the same as my dad, though. True, that's true. Maybe she didn't want us to take a personal angle. Which is confusing, given the prompt, but... I saw... Susan... Anderson got an A. You know what she wrote about? No. Her fucking dog. No. A dog. No. Yeah. Yeah. Because I've read some of Susan's stuff. Like, she asked me. She asked me yeah, for help. Yeah. And it was just, like, totally bad. She was in remedial. Yeah. I don't Freshman even know, year. I don't even know. Freshman how, year. I don't even know how she got into AP English. Two years ago, she was remedial. Remedial. What did she even... Because she probably just writes about dogs all the time. You know, because... She's obsessed with dogs. And I bet Mrs. Lilith just, like, saw the dog stuff, and she just, like, gave her an A right off the top. Mrs. Lilith probably loves dogs. I hear she's lonely as hell. Old bat. Fiona, I have an idea. <laughs> Scene? <Sure. laughs> yeah, we know where that's going. You're right. We know where that's going. <laughs> I knew where this was going the second you started talking. <laughs> <laughs> All right, okay. yeah, I'll just pass that right back. Susan, what was it that I said? Anderson. Anderson. Susan Anderson, Mrs. Lilith. All right, Ben, what's uh, <laughs> what's Jason Futz up to? All right, so it's the period before lunch. Uh, the worst period of the day. They're sitting in uh, physics, and uh, Whipple is there. Mm -hmm. uh, you can all be there if you want. Oh, oh, do you? Uh, yeah. <laughs> sure. Uh, <clears throat> uh, Futz torments you, but... He's actually trying to get your attention, and he's disguising it as torment. Okay. Hey, uh... <laughs> hey, uh, Whipple. What? What are you looking so sad about? Not another unboxing video to watch today, huh? <laughs> what a dweeb. <laughs> Throws a crumpled ball of paper at your head. Ow! He unwraps it beneath his desk. Meet me today at 3 p.m. In the locker room. <laughs> <laughs> you like that? If you didn't have your phone, head stuck in your phone all the time, you might actually have some uh, hand-eye coordination. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Shut up, Jason. Isn't he a dweeb, Susan? I'm yeah, bringing that he back. sucks. Dweeb. So... Susan, Ooh. you excited to go to the dance with me? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so excited, Jason. Yeah. Your little, uh, your little friends came up to me. They Who? T they told me you've been talking about it all week. You know, just Sherry and <laughs> Mary. Okay. <laughs> Said yeah. you're 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 really thrilled about uh, going to the dance with the big old quarterback. Well, Who's like way not into dweeb stuff? Yeah, yeah. Who else would I go with? Okay. Also, your little brother is still cool to watch my dog, right? When we're going, I need someone to watch my dog, oh, Jason. Oh no! Oh, I forgot to tell you this, Susan, my little bro. He's gonna be going to the Pokemon Trading Car World Championships. He's not gonna be able to make it. The same night as the dance? Yeah. He's been working really hard on that. I know it. It's super lame, but what even uh, is that? Yeah, I don't know. It's it. 
They po- call it uh, poke? the poke. Like a fish? Yeah, Susan. Yeah, right. Like, you don't know what Pokemon is. The fish? No, yeah, right. Yeah, right, Susan. You Elias- know what Pokemon is, and you know there's cards for it. What are you talking about, Elias? I don't you've, know anything seen, about that. You've seen this before. Tell oh, me you've not seen this like before. Like magic? The this gathering? is why the closest you'll get, Whipple, to a significant other is an online tutorial, all right? I boned three girls last week, bro. Who? Okay. Who? Cherry. All right. Mary. Those are my two best friends. <laughs> you did not bone my two best friends, the other Elias. Sh- the other you Sherry and Mary. The other right. Sherry and Mary. You didn't bone them. The, yes. v- the VR chat room That's doesn't nice. count, Whipple. We it talked does. About- yes, because it's still a sexual experience. It absolutely it's, does count. It's not nice to tell lies about Sherry. She's in a wheelchair. Other Sherry? In the VR realm, she is not. So, in the you, VR so realm- you banged her in VR. Yes. I, That's mis- fine. Hey, Mr. Button. Yeah. <laughs> you okay with this? I'm trying to learn about yeah. Newton or some I'd, shit. I'd appreciate it if you kids would not talk about virtual reality boning, as you say, <laughs> during physics class. You're speaking very loudly. I'm trying to talk about Newton and the concept of gravity, the theory of gravity. And why do we call it a theory class? Because it can't be proved. We can't prove it. That's right. Good job, uh, Jason. Yeah, some of us are trying to go somewhere in life. Go ahead. Tell us all about gravity. Well, it's a force based on mass and uh, centrifugal (laughs) speed. (laughs) And (laughs) scene. Was that a success for Jason? Yeah, because you got the note. Like, we'll meet meet at 3 p.m. Uh, So you give that away to somebody. (laughs) Oh, my God. (laughs) Gravity, it's a myth, who knows? Uh, All right, (laughs) what's Chris Townsend up to? All right, so it's after lunch now. Mm -hmm. We're in PE class, and uh, it's the day we have to run the, uh, the the quarter mile in under a certain amount of time day that a lot of us hate and stuff Mm -hmm. so uh we're walking out Mm -hmm. to the track outside yeah uh after we left the locker room and uh bumping into uh jason and uh he's looking pretty uh looking pretty excited about this uh this uh, this quarter mile oh and uh obviously we'll see like how i feel about it okay (sighs) oh man i why does it have to be quarter mile day? Oh, can we just like play like indoor volleyball or something? Indoor volleyball? That's for girls. <laughs> oh, I'm I'm sorry, but I, I kind of find it to be fun to play that. Not everyone just likes to run around in circles. It's the most boring thing ever. Come on. Like, what do you get out of this? You get the satisfaction of improving yourself. <laughs> Let me tell you about improving yourself. It's a constant struggle, all right? You can't go through life when you're out there working your dead-end job in a couple of years, all right? (laughs) You're not going to like it. This right now, this little quarter mile, might seem like it sucks. But you get through it, you'll be able to handle the sucky things a little bit better. (laughs) Man, Jason, you just think the world of yourself, don't you? You think you're going somewhere in life because you can run the quarter mile? <laughs> Listen, I've already talked to the yearbook crew. Oh. Sweeping them. Sweeping every category, even the ones that don't make any sense. Uh, I think they're just saying that to your face because they're trying to be nice to you this year. Because I, if I look at the last year's yearbook, yeah, I think you weren't in any categories last year, were you? Yeah. No, they really wanted to send the message home with me being a senior now. So, uh, yeah, never told a joke in my life. Funniest guy. Ah, I see. Very um, serious person. Funniest guy. That's what they told me. <laughs> what are uh, you getting? What are uh, you getting? Well, manager at Target. No. In 15 years. No, but yeah. I'm uh, I'm doing better than you know our little uh, after school religious class that we're doing. Oh there. God. Yeah. You really think that religion and Jesus is gonna like deliver you a great life and everything like that is it is jesus gonna come down and bless you with the 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 funniest award like the class the funniest person because uh i don't see that happening you know i uh my parents were like hey they're gonna teach you good lessons and stuff 
but they just rail on about the things they don't like. Talk about Harry Potter, who even cares, and uh, Pokemon. They just go on and on about how much they hate it. It's more like a hate group than anything else, huh? <laughs> that was a joke. First one. <clears throat> you know, you know what? It's cool. It's cool. We're still we're still good buds and everything like that. Because you know what? You can you can talk about being the funniest person. Because at the end of the day, we know that uh, I'm a. I know your weakness, dude. Oh I, yeah. I, I know. Oh I yeah. Know, I know that I'm actually the biggest. I'm the biggest Green Day fan. Ah. Uh. You sound like a real American idiot to me. <laughs> hey, Thompson! Are you bullying him? Yeah. No, I'm not bullying him. T Thompson! He's, th he's the one over he's here. trying to meditate over here. I just have to listen to him. You just shouting Every my- Every single week we have the bully and talk, Thompson! <laughs> I'm not bullying. I'm writing you I'm up. I'm just expressing my opinions I'm here. I'm writing you up. What's with- what's, what's, I can't express myself? What's hey, wrong with that? Stop trying to make everything political. I'm not Are just you trying politically to go for a run. bullying him? Yeah. I'm not politic. Stop putting words in my I'm mouth. I'm running you up. Come on. Go to the principals in your gym clothes. This is the worst day ever. Come on. <laughs> Make this. Have a nice run to the principal's office. See you later, futz. <laughs> <laughs> nice. So you give that to somebody. I'm the biggest Green Day fan. <laughs> <laughs> That's his weakness. <clears throat> um. <clears throat> Okay, so it's uh, the end of the day, sixth period, uh, which Fiona has for the yearbook group, uh, which she is on, uh, and um, Chris Townsend is also on the yearbook group, mm -hmm. uh, and um, so are other Sherry and other Mary. Got it. Who are not your best friends. Well, that's Susan. Susan's best friend. Susan's cool girl, and that's like oh. Sherry and Mary of the Mean Girls or whatever. Mm -hmm. The other Sherry and other Mary are Fiona Apple Day Billings' friends. Got it. Mm -hmm. that's, that's good. That's good. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And uh, they're also in the yearbook group. Uh, and so, yeah. Um, yeah. All right. So, um, uh, yeah, it's getting toward the end of the year. We need to decide all the categories. Um, like class clown, funniest, um, which, why do we have both of those? Aren't they the same thing? Uh, I kind of feel like class clown is like the goofiest. It, his jokes don't necessarily land all the time, but he just really puts himself out there. Sure. Whereas class funniest can be more subtle, uh, more uh, full Nuanced. of humor, more witty. Yeah. yeah. Uh, so should we call it like goofiest? No, class clown makes it the most humiliating. Okay, sure. Okay. Thanks, Mary. Um, uh, Chris, um, how's how's the like? I don't know what sports, whatever that you do. Uh, yeah. Sorry, I'm falling a little behind on it. I didn't have like the greatest time. Just got out of the principal's office and everything. Why'd you have to go to the principal's? I had trouble again? during PE again because was... like this happens every week, Chris. Chris, do you I need know, to, but like, do you need to talk. This is like. It's society's fault, I feel like. This is just, like, yeah. not my problem. Yeah. It's not a me thing. It's a Jesus. society thing. Hey, hey, don't encourage him. He needs to get this done. How's that new category, Trending Gamer, going? <laughs> well, the Trending Gamer... You wanted to well, bring it in here, huh? Okay, well, I yeah, mean... Yeah, Chris, I don't I understand did, Trending Gamer. Can you explain <laughs> yeah, it to so me? Yeah, so Trending Gamer is, like, the most... Kind of, like, the most popular... A uh, person who's making videos about uh, video but games and playing just, them. But they're all just live streamers. I mean, the, you can you kind of see it that way, but like, there's definitely a difference. So it might be subtle to someone like you, but did they someone like me, yeah. Chris? What does that even mean? You don't really Chris? watch these types of videos. You're always right. pretending don't. we don't understand. Yeah, we know don't. it's just gonna be ninja. Okay, just get it done. Well, actually, yeah, ninja. I mean, ninja's pretty good. I mean, I won't lie. But uh, uh, I was also considering. I was doing some of my research and. Uh, uh, I was looking at uh, Elias Whipple. He's making some uh, pretty good YouTube uh, Let's Play videos. Chris. Uh, talking about Pokemon. <clears throat> this is supposed to be an article about the greater world, not about <sighs> our school. Chris, we were. Which like I guess doesn't make sense for our yearbook now that I think about it. Why did Miss Lilith want us to do that? I don't know. I think she's trying to, like, live through us or something like that. She's been like, very she distracted lately. She oh, does she seem has? really. Yes. Yeah. What do you mean? What do you mean? Mary? Yeah. She's always staring down at her phone, sad. 
I swear <gasps> I saw her crying in her car last night. Do you think really? she got rejected on like a Tinder or something? Constantly. Oh. Chris, we were talking before you got here. Yeah. Fiona Apple like makes a note. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> We kind of think you created this category just so Jason can't win one. That's that's absurd. No, I'm still absolutely not. How not. many subscribers does Whipple even have? Yeah, I mean, pretty good for someone who goes to our school. If it's less than 100k, get out of here. <sighs> but they're trying really hard. They're all, they're like they're at what 80, is it? They're at eighty nine thousand. They're at eighty nine thousand. They're so close. You know that's way gonna, better. If than we're gonna I make thought. this hundred k, fine. You know what? Fine. We'll just Here's go with hundred k. Here's the thing. Mm -hmm. I know that we introduced that category so that Jason wouldn't win one. Yeah. I think it's risky. Jason's got dirt on all four of us. Chris, he knows about your thing. Mm -hmm. He knows about my thing. Jason plays Fortnite. That's gonna get him pretty far. I didn't even know he plays Fortnite. Yeah. That's crazy. Yeah. But here's the thing. Sherry, Mary. Yeah. If we don't let Jason win every category like he told us to do, he's going to crucify us. And like, look, frankly, I don't care. I don't really care. Yeah. But I like, mean, he's got one million Twitter followers that are going to come after us. Jason has a million Twitter followers. It's I checked. It's I checked crazy. last night. He hit a million. They've got to be all bots. Not a single well, like, bot. I ran my bot program. Not one. Not yeah. one. We spent Not hours going through them bot. manually, too. Like, why, pretty why legit. Are you got, why he are you doing that? so big in Canada, and I don't know why. Toronto area What does he even him. do? I did some research. It's this Fortnite. It's this Fortnite. Not only does he win Victory Royale in every game he streams, in every game he streams, he can do the floss better than anyone. Look, just because Jason's dad owns the police department, the school, everything... Donated all that money to the hospital. You know what I think that it is? It doesn't make him better than us. You know what I think it is? What? My research did unearth something a little seedy. Oh. His godfather works at Epic. Whoa. I think there's something going on there. Whoa. You can't get victory out every time. You can't. Just you can't. like because sometimes it's just like random, like where the loot's gonna drop. Exactly. This is a big scoop. How'd you find this out? I want to be a computer science major. That's I'm great, Sherry. To yeah, you should do it. You should do it, Sherry. Yeah, okay. I, all right. I just... Just don't tell anyone. Okay? There's nothing to be ashamed of. Computers hey. are big. Yeah, but... You know, people think of me as the fashion girl. Mm. Well, yeah. Yeah. And it's just a little... Claustrophobic. I want to... I like... Code, okay. I like that's code. That's fine. That's nothing to be ashamed of. Hey, while we're sharing yeah. stuff, uh huh. I did a lot of freaky stuff in VR last week with Elias. <laughs> Elias Whipple? Yeah. Did Wait, this that, involve that shit he was talking about in physics class was true? Yeah, we go into. <laughs> I was sitting in the back reading because <laughs> physics class sucks. Hey, Whipple. It does. Yeah. Can you just answer? No, one? So, well, I'm not Whipple. I'm sorry. That's yeah. Mary. Yeah. <laughs> I'm sorry, Mary. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I thought Whipple. That's my friend, Mary. Yeah. <laughs> my can, friend. Can you answer me one question? Yeah. Did it involve Simon characters again? <sighs> yes. They're very bangable. They're. <laughs> we, and it's not just that. It's like. It's easier for me to pretend that I can be like out there and exciting when I'm a Sonic character. You know, even when I'm Tails, I'm something more than myself. Which one is your favorite? Mm. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> Sonic. <laughs> yeah, wow. he kind of has. To. What a lame answer. You could have picked something cool, but like it's trending, like silver. <laughs> sure. <laughs> sure, that would have been a better answer. <laughs> As, as long as we're sharing, mm -hmm. uh, I did something kind of bad. Um, I, uh, well, you know, my dad had that new car. Uh, I crashed it. What? What do you mean? Are you okay? I'm fine. You yeah. can drive? Well, yeah. apparently not. I got, they well, crashed. Yeah. <laughs> Thanks, Chris. That's fair. Just being honest here. Yeah, no, but it... I, it was last night. I hit it. I hit some dog. And don't, I, don't you get like a lot of free cars anyway? Cause your uncle. Yeah. 
Yeah, I mean, so nobody cared, but it like, was the dog okay? No, it died. And what I think do I think it was Susan's dog. I didn't have the heart. What do you mean you think it was Susan's dog? I think it was Susan's dog. Well, Whoa. was it was it like three feet tall and brown? Yeah. That's Susan's dog. I think she was staying over at other Sherry and other Mary's house. Uh -huh. You know, the mean ones. Yeah. And she night. brought Grimley over? No, she didn't know. That's why I'm saying she doesn't know that the dog is dead. So, like, Grimley went looking for her because she spent one night away from him. Yeah. And I killed it. <gasps> Day Billings. Yeah? She's going to, like, totally block you. That's fine. I don't care about that. Whoa. It's like <laughs> social suicide, though. You do know that, right? Yeah. That's... And then, like, all her friends are going to block you? What'd you do with the dog? And then Jace is going to block you? Just leave it there? It's in the trunk of the car. And then you're going to get, like, banned on Twitter. Trunk? It's, it's in, in the, the parking trunk? lot. It's in the trunk. You got it? We, we got to get it out of your yeah, trunk. Yeah, we got to do something. You can't have a dog in your trunk. This is... I don't know. What if you get caught? I say it climbed in there. I don't... I, I a, don't dead, know. a dead dog climbed into your trunk. Well, it probably died in the trunk effort. I don't know. Doesn't I don't it, know. I panicked. Uh, doesn't it smell? Yeah. Yeah. Really bad. We have to tell her. bad. Wait. Those cops right now, they protect the school. <laughs> they go into the parking lot. Oh, shit. They have a sniffing dog. He's probably going to smell a dead dog in a truck. Yeah, you got to do Wait. something fast. Don't you also do drugs? <laughs> <laughs> Who told you that? <laughs> See? <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck is that? That's a black dog. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Who, uh, told you that? <laughs> Who told you that? Who told you that? Uh, you don't have one yet, right? No. no that one's for you, not... What? Unmix the dice. Oh, right, right, right. The rest of those are... Uh, <laughs> yeah. yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Um, okay. <laughs> what a scene. Okay. Uh, Elias Whipple, yeah. Locker room. Yeah. Elias has his uh, binder of Pokemon cards out, sifting through them. Uh, Jason comes in. He is listening to music on his phone. <laughs> okay. Don't have been American yet. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, Whipple. Shh. Why are you listening to that so loud? Because, I, like, all right, the thing about Green Day that people don't understand is they just, like, tune in. They don't even listen to the words. And it's, like, about how unfair it is under the system, dude. Like, these kids don't even understand. Yeah, I'm just saying there's probably, like, three other secret meetings in the locker room right now. Oh, we don't all right. need to be yeah. Oh, yeah, this is super. Uh, all right, you're right, you're right. Whipple, you're right. Hey, and I, you know what? I, uh, I'm sorry about physics. I, I, it's no, just. I get it. Like, if people know that we're friends, it's like gonna throw everything absolutely. off. I get that. Absolutely. Hey, you're still, you're still good for duos tonight? Yeah. All right. Okay. Hey, okay, so here's my binary. Here's everything I got. I don't have a holographic polyrath, but I have some good stuff in there. No, it's not, it's not your full Whipple. It's just, it'll really complete my water fighting deck. I just need polyrath, all right? But I don't understand. He's not even strategically viable. <laughs> okay. You know how I was talking about Green Day and American Idiot and how, like, there's more there? Yeah. My bro, all he cares about is stats and winning and GX. But he's good. Yeah, he's good. I have a connection to these cards and these Pokemon, okay? It's not about winning. It's about showing people the heart of Polyrath, okay? <laughs> yeah. And, like... I have a connection with these mons one in of the, a way. One of the football guys comes by and, and ass snaps uh, Jason with a towel. Oh. Hey, Jason! <laughs> yeah. Hey, what good. are you talking to this dweeb for? Hey, good snap, man. Yeah. I'll have to get you back for that. Yeah, yeah. Uh, I'm hit the shower. I was just about to shove him in this locker, you know, keep it real 1980. Yeah, <laughs> he was making fun of me. He was making yeah, fun of me. Yeah, yeah. Nice. Yeah. Nice. Wait, yeah. hey, right. why are you here? Just, what? Why are you here at 3 p.m. taking showers. Because we're about to go to football practice. I got to shower up. Shower before, shower after, baby. No, shower after? Why are you showering before? Got to right. stay fresh, bitch. <laughs> <laughs> he shoves him yes. into the lockers. <laughs> uh, Jason just stands in front of it and crosses his arms. Hey. Yeah. You heard the new Green Day song? Yeah, it fucking sucks. <laughs> he walks off. Oh. You don't like butt revolution? Come on. I'm not even... I can't... What? <laughs> just gone. <laughs> Hey, Whipple. Yeah. You okay? Yeah. All right. See you tonight. Wait. I saw... I saw a holographic polygraph... Polygraph... On eBay last night. 
I can't buy it. My parents won't let me use the, my credit card because I bought too many skins. Uh, <laughs> but like, if you can find a way, they're actually pretty cheap. I uh, I got banned on eBay. <laughs> From the snake thing? Yeah. Uh, yeah, I can't. I can't go into it. It's uh, really, uh, you know, adults only business. But sure. If we can find somebody with an eBay account, we can get you a polygraph. Otherwise, I don't know what we can do. I think uh, I think I think Susan's in good standing on there. The snake thing didn't get her too bad. <laughs> hey, are you like um like dating Susan? No, we don't even really like each other. It's just you know, like Green Day's <laughs> uh, in their song "When September Ends," <laughs> <laughs> that sometimes the world forces you together. Even if you don't want to be. Yeah, yeah. That's why I choose Polyrath. Well, like, you should talk to her about it. Yeah. Like, as long as you're, like, you know, like, going to dances together and stuff, like, might as well. How do you think she'll take it? Oh, uh, just say it's for your brother. Uh, that's the easiest excuse. All right. She pr- she doesn't know that Polyrath is no good card. Like, she doesn't even know. So, yeah. like, just say it's for your little brother. You're right. He's got to win. The, he's got to win. win. He's, he's got to like win. He's got to win. Friday, right? Yeah, he's got to win Worlds in Toronto. Yeah. They love me up there. All right, all right. Okay. All right, finally, finally my September will end. All right. <laughs> Thanks for the talk, Whipple. Yeah, hey. see you, dude. After high school, I'll invite you over to my house. I'm looking forward to that day, brother. <laughs> see you. <laughs> Is that uh, a white you handed yeah, out? Yeah, I had it okay, a white. Yeah, it, nice knocked white. A, it knocked a black okay. uh, over, so give, all right, give Ben the black back. And he gets that white, too. Okay, okay. cool. Uh, cool. All right, so what's Jason up to now? Uh, so Jason is going to go talk to Susan okay. uh, to try to convince her to use her good standing <laughs> eBay account to get this polyrath okay, card okay. for his brother. <laughs> hey, Susie Q. Hey, Jason. Hey, uh, so I got a surprise for you. At school? Uh, no, better. Should we leave for this? Yeah, Sherry, Mary, I'll catch you guys later. Okay. Bye, Jason. So, uh, I know your favorite place to eat. Yeah. I know it's Olive Garden. Yeah. I know that you don't like to tell your friends because it's, you know, not good for you. But, yeah. uh, you get really down on those free breadsticks. Yeah. Uh, I made a reservation for before the dance. We're, Jason, that's rad. Thanks. We're going to Olive Garden, baby. Get your Alfredo on. That's pretty cool. Yeah, I can't it's pretty eat cool. too much breadsticks no. before the dance. That'll look all bloated, but whatever. I won't tell anyone. It's going to be a private dinner, just you and me, babe. Okay. So, babe. Is there some angle here? Yeah, what's <laughs> going on? Well, you know, I'm trying to teach you a lesson here. You're trying to teach me <laughs> a lesson? Uh, It's an educational lesson. You know, I get you those... Most are. I get you those breadsticks, babe. Uh, you just do a little favor for me. What do you think? Fine, let's go to your car. No. <laughs> no. No, we we made a rule. What? That's not a transactional thing. <laughs> Jason, obviously you're not a girl in high school in 2018, okay? I uh you know how you you uh you buy stuff on eBay sometimes? Yeah, eBay's great. Need you to get something for me, babe. What? So you know my bro? Yeah. How he's like a total loser. Yeah, who and won't watch my fucking dog. Yeah, well, it turns out he's going to this this Pokemon card tournament, all right? I don't even know what it is, but uh, there's a lot of money on the line, babe. Okay. And uh, he needs this this card to complete his uh, his dick, or no, I'm sorry, his deck. That's what he calls it. To complete his dick? No, it's... <laughs> Jason, get your head out of the gutter, Jesus. <laughs> no, he needs to complete his deck, babe. Uh-huh. And uh, I need you to get him this card. Fine. He found a really good price on eBay. <laughs> okay. What is uh, it? From this user, just Darth text, Sidious just text XXX. Me a link. Send me a link. All right. All right. All right. You'll, so you'll do it. Yeah. I mean, you're going to pay me back. You'll get the card, back, babe. Right? You're going to pay me back? I am paying you back with the breadsticks, babe. <laughs> pay me back with money, Jason. It's like you buy something for someone and you just pay me for it. But All right, I mean, so you know... It'll be a nice evening. Have you ever listened to the album Dookie? Hey, Fiona, <laughs> Hey, is everything okay here? Yeah, I'm Susan. Sorry, Susan, is everything okay here? Don't ever 
compare me to Fiona ever again. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Yeah. That I'm sorry. dweeb is a dweeb. I know. Capital D. Yes. I yeah. don't. You get me confused with the other Mary all the time. Look, it's because you're both, you know, have that kind of like skin thing. Is, is everything okay here? Do everything. Hey, Mary, uh, Mary, it's fine. Go okay, away. Okay. I, I don't. I don't think you. I'll meet you in my. I don't car. think you have enough Instagram likes to to even question. Jason, us. Jason, come on. We heard you. We saw you yelling. Look, Was I yelling, babe? Mary, everything's fine. Okay, everything's yeah. fine. Okay, that's what I thought. That's what I thought. You, okay. Yeah, that's what I meet thought. Meet me right. in my car. I'll uh-huh. meet you out there in a okay. second. Bye. Yeah. Okay. See you in a second. Try We're another filter. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Bye. Yeah. Jason, don't yell at my friends about their Instagram. Okay. Hey. Not everyone can have as many followers as we do. It's okay. Uh, you mean as I do? <laughs> You've only got 500k, babe. Yeah, on Insta, that's pretty good. <laughs> hey, you've got a million on Twitter. Hey. Twitter is whatever. Okay. Yeah, I know it's a dying. I know it's a dying form, but yeah. uh, suggestion. It's a, you might as well be on Snapchat. Suggestion. What? We go to that Olive Garden. You take a good photo of that Alfredo. You're gonna get. Use the hashtag, family. Boost your count. I can't let people. Mm. <laughs> Fine. <laughs> See. Yeah, See. <laughs> Fine. <laughs> <laughs> All right. What's Chris Townsend up to? All right. Let's fast forward to the next day. Oh, okay. So, uh, it's one the weekend now. We're on a Saturday. We're at the uh, Promised Hill Fairway. And uh, I'm running into Jason there on the driving range. Because he plays golf? Yeah. Oh, okay. Uh, like, yeah, both our families take us to play golf and stuff. And, like, mm-hmm. I ha- every once a month we have to go golfing. Mm-hmm. And uh, I always run into this uh, this fool. And uh, <laughs> but this time I, I might have something. I might be able to finally get back. We'll see. What's up, Jason? You got to drive the ball on the fairway this time? Townsend, have you ever played golf in your life? Yeah, I do. Uh, what's your handicap at now? Heard it's it, my <laughs> yeah, what's your handicap at? I heard uh, last time I checked, uh, you're still playing from the 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 the, the kitty the kitty tee. You get to play with the big boy tees back in the back. Townsend, I haven't I haven't seen you on the green since preschool. All right, I may have had a, a handicap in preschool, yeah, but it's cause, uh, uh, in preschool I was uh, making those hole in ones on those par threes, but. <laughs> You know what? <laughs> I didn't. I didn't come here today actually to argue with golf for once, cause uh, I came here to make a p- business proposal to you. A business proposal? Yeah. See, uh, I don't think you noticed yesterday, but uh, in the locker room, I just happened to walk by and I overheard something about a holographic polyrath card. What did you hear, Townsend? <gasps> well, I heard you're looking for one, and you're in dire need of one. So, uh. <laughs> got on my dad's eBay account last night and uh, had a same day delivery here to the golf course. And uh, uh, Edward's gonna bring it out in just a second, but uh, we, Townsend, we have it right here. You son of a bitch! <laughs> I, I know. And uh, here's what's gonna happen. Hey, Townsend, Townsend, before we get started, I need to tell you the importance of that card. Okay. Well, okay. Six years ago, I took a BuzzFeed quiz. Okay. Oh, those are very important. They are. Yeah, important. they are. They are important. I took him very seriously. Okay. Oh. Word is law. That is true. It said, which Pokemon would be the best companion for you? You know who I got? Who'd you get? I got Paul Roth. I see. So it all makes sense now. It's uh, it's Destiny Townsend. Whatever shenanigans you're trying to pull here, keeping me from my uh, Poke Partner. Uh, I don't much care for it. Listen, Jason, it's no secret. No secret. We don't always get along and stuff, but he- just hear me out this time. Because this could... We could both come out on top with this. <laughs> I don't care about this holographic Polyrath card. I never really cared about Pokemon. It's okay. And you know what? How you feel about Green Day? We've always been at... You know what? We you know we both love Green Day. But you know what? I'm not interested in Green Day either this time. You see, I'm absolutely fed up with this after-school religious class, this Christian class I keep going to. I know some of you love it and stuff, but you know what? I want out. I want out of it, and you know what? I'm going to make a deal with you. All right. 
So this is what you're going to do. Edward shows up and opens the case. Yes. <laughs> so the holographic oh polygraph is right there. I am willing to part with this on two <laughs> conditions. One, you show up every day at that lame brain little Jesus fellowship up at Apple Valley. Hey, I hit that place too. And you just sign in for me, make an appearance and stuff, you know, to sign in and stuff. And then you just leave. You just got to do it and stuff. Because all they care about is you sign in. They don't even pay attention there. It's like, spew Jesus this, uh, you know, uh, commandments that, all that stuff. <laughs> but, like, there's, like, 50 kids in the class. They don't know everyone's name. They just, like, they just don't care. So you just need to, like, sign in. You can leave. I don't care whatever you do you want. But I don't even want to go near that place. So all I got to do is sign your name for this Jesus Freak Club, and you're going to give me... Yeah, because... Well, this holographic well, hang on. I said there's huh? two parts. It's, okay. obvious, it's also because I don't have a car. I don't want to drive the other side of town for this stupid thing. I want to pay for gas. So you always you... were annoyingly practical, Townsend. Yeah, I know. I don't like I don't like cost of gas and stuff. It sucks right now. It's hard for all of us. But listen to this. This is the important one. Because this is the one you need to understand. You are going to tweet a photo of us together. <gasps> Hash- yes. Because... You're going to get my Twitter and Instagram follower account to boost. <gasps> Edward's hands start trembling. Yeah. <laughs> and, if you, and if you do not agree to this, you don't get the card. But I'm willing to give you an option, a, a, a second option here if you don't want to do this. Because I know this one will be even harder for you. Either do this for me or take your name out of the running for all the yearbook awards. I got one question for you, Townsend. Yeah. What's the hashtag? Hashtag Besties. That's the big one, the big B right there. A guy, a guy who is kind of like listening in, who's mm-hmm. just driving next to him, totally whiffs at the drive and throws yeah. his club. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> so uh, stop swinging for yeah. a second. <laughs> I'm sure you know Townsend because you have your nose in where it don't belong. Uh, but uh, on the Jason Futz subreddit, <laughs> for approximately. 48 months. Yeah. The top thread there. When's Futt's gonna pop the besties? <laughs> <laughs> so you realize uh, what you're asking here. It's a big deal. It is a big deal. And you know what? Because I'm feeling like such a good sport today, I will let you forego the besties hashtag <laughs> in exchange for <laughs> hashtag Green Day Frauds. <laughs> what? <laughs> because I know this is a front you've put on since freshman year. I know you hate Green Day. Oh, no. I know you absolutely hate it as much as I hate Green Day. You cannot stand them. This has to end. I know we made this stupid pack to keep it up to make Green Day cool again, but they're not cool anymore. We gotta make this end, and it's driving me insane, dude. The polyrath starts shining even more. (laughs) It just starts glimmering. Just do this one thing and end it. (laughs) Free us from this. Townsend, I don't know how you figured this out, but uh, I guess it's time for my love of Weezer to shine. (laughs) (laughs) It's it's, it's, Yeah. So you got the white. It's that polyrath, though. Give that to somebody. Uh, Okay. Wait, now? Yeah, Yeah. give it to somebody. Okay, so uh, it's... So that was Saturday morning. This is Friday night, the previous night. Oh, okay. Uh, it's 3.25. Elias is coming out of the um, locker room. Mm-hmm. And Fiona is leaning against the wall. And uh, she's kind of eyeing the parking lot and waiting for Elias. And then she sees she sees you come out. Elias. Yeah. Yeah. Come on. Come with me. Come to my car. Uh, so uh, we go out to my car. And uh, the cops... The cop dog, it, we're, they're sniffing around in the parking lot, um, but they I par- I always park at the far end of the parking lot, like mm-hmm. the far corner. Yeah. I'm like, we got to get out of here. Come on. And the, the front of her car is dented in and bloody. Dented in. Yeah, yeah. yeah. And, and the car smells. Yeah. Like weird. Yeah. Uh, and I'm like, just ignore it. Just get in. Ignore it. Ignore it. Okay. Uh, okay. Wow. What, is this? what happened? Why does it smell like this? Look, there's a dead dog in my trunk. I can't <gasps> explain. It's fine. I killed Susan's dog. <gasps> Fuck her. Gromley? Yeah. 
Grimly. Grimly? You killed Grimly? I don't know its name, but it's dead and it's in my trunk and it's Everyone stinks. loves Grimly. Yeah, I know. I'm sorry, okay? Are you sure Sometimes he's dead? you hit a dog. I'm pretty sure he smells dead. <gasps> anyway, look. Mrs. Lilith always leaves the school at at uh, 328 every day. She has like 15 minutes of crap, whatever. I don't know. She's like a clock. Mm -hmm. And here she comes. We're going to follow her. We're going to follow her to wherever the hell she goes after school on Friday nights. Yeah. We're going to meet her. And we're going to find out what she's into. Yeah. Enact the plan. Yes. You know? Enact yeah. the plan. We're going to double team this chick. Mm -hmm. It'll be fine. Okay. Uh, and then uh, if she doesn't raise, raise our grades, um, mm, I guess we'll destroy her. The plan is not going to fail. Well, it better not. She's going to be sexually attracted to one of us. Or both. <laughs> or both. Right. All right, here she comes. She's getting in her car. No, I think we got to get rid of this dead dog first. What? How are we going to tail someone and get rid of a dead dog at the same time? It's just... It's and the cops are it's coming. Uh, the cops are right there. Yeah, go, They're like go, four cars away. Go! Go! Right, let's go. Well, i got to fly casual here. <laughs> All right. So I drive <laughs> off. We're following Mrs. Lilith. Miss Lilith, I guess. Um... And uh, she's driving, and she goes to um, uh, she goes to the Samsung Memorial Applebee's mm -hmm. in Apple Valley, and uh, pulls in. And I'm like, shit, she's going to the Applebee's. I'm not allowed in there. <laughs> Why? Cause mm, one of the waiters grabbed my ass, so I kind of stabbed his hand with a fork. So. You know, kind of balanced out, I guess. Yeah, the, you got in trouble for that? I got, yeah. That's society. Society That's fucking society. sucks, Elias. Yeah. yeah. Anyway, maybe they just won't notice it's me. It's okay. been like a year and a half. All right. Um, here, I've got like another hoodie. Oh, God, it smells like dead dog. Everything smells like dead dog. Everything smells like dead dog. I, like that. I know. Here, here, I'll park by the dumpster. We'll ditch the dead dog. Okay. I don't want to touch it, though. Applebee's dumpsters are locked. Trust me on this. Why do you know that? I just said trust me on this. Well, th well let's just put it next to the dumpster. It's all the same. Okay. People are going to recognize Grimly. He's a very popular dog. Uh, I don't think they'll recognize him. <laughs> we, we park by the dumpsters, <laughs> and I open the trunk, and his head is just gone. Oh. <laughs> uh, and there are, like, maggots. I'm like, wow. God, I didn't know shit decayed so fast. Fiona, I'm not touching this. I'm not touching I'm it. Not touching I'm this. not touching it. One of you's gonna have to touch it. What? Kids. Who, who are you? You're coming down to the station with me. What? <gasps> but Mrs. Lilith is walking into the Applebee's. But but we have we have a meeting with our teacher in the Applebee's. You come willingly, or I put cuffs on you. Who are you, like a cop? What is the... You're not You're not dressed like a cop. I'm Applebee Security. <laughs> what station are you taking us to? Applebee's <laughs> Central? We, we got a place. This is the best reviewed Applebee's in the county. We can afford it for <laughs> troublemakers like you. Look, look. I didn't know. I didn't know it was Grimly. I just got in her Shh, car. Elias, it's Elias. the Grimly? <laughs> <laughs> just, <laughs> <laughs> now you're in big trouble, boys. Fiona, Fiona takes out... <laughs> Boys, Girls. Girls. you're wearing the hoodie. You're right. I'm wearing this stinky hoodie. Look, Fiona reaches in her purse and take in her pocket and takes out like a wad of cash, and it's just like, ugh, fine. Here, how about here's six hundred bucks to keep your mouth shut. Okay. You can't even buy an Applebee's sirloin steak for that. You're gonna have to do better. For six hundred dollars? Oh, I didn't realize how much it was. These Here. guys are serious. Hey. These guys are serious. Fine. Hey. Fine. What? I'll only take your money on one condition. Yeah? You take that famous dog. You dump it over at the Chili's. Fine. After our meeting, we'll dump it at the Chili's. Okay? I don't think their dumpsters are locked. Elias, are their dumpsters locked? Chili's dumpsters are not locked. Yeah, <laughs> so we'll dump it at Chili's. Fine. You've got 30 minutes. All right. Thanks. We're gonna have to leave Ms. Lilith. We gotta do this now. No, we got- I'm not getting in trouble with Applebee's security again. We just paid up off Applebee's security. We have a half hour to go in there, seduce Lilith, That's then not dump the- time. Then we That's dump the dog at Chili's. Let's we'll dump up. the dog at Chili's. Let's split up. Split up. Split up. Split up. Fine. 
But I want us to do... Okay, rock, paper, scissors. <sighs> Fine. All right. Wait, on shoot. Okay. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Damn it. <laughs> so wait, which one do I do and which one do you do? You got to dump that dog. Fuck. All right. Fine. But after I dump it, I'm coming in. Okay. All right. I'll wingman you or whatever it is. Sure, sure. All right. So uh, mm -hmm. you you head into the Applebee's mm -hmm. and I I drive to the Chili's and uh and I'm like ah, I don't want to touch it and I don't have like gloves or anything so I'm like I go into the Chili's and talk to the hostess I'm like uh hey, hey uh hi um hi uh, hi I uh I spilled Do you a table for one no uh actually sorry this is a little weird I'm I'm not actually coming to Chili's. Uh, I spilled a, a pop, a soda, mm -hmm. in my car. Yeah. And uh, do you have, like, a plastic bag and some paper towels I could use? Yeah, of course we have Thank that. you. Thank you so much. Thanks. Uh, so she gets a couple of plastic bags and mm -hmm. some paper towels, and uh, she, like, looks around. And then she puts the plastic bags over her hands and, like, tries to pick up... What's his name? Grimly? Grimly. Tries to pick up Grimly and, like... He's heavy. He's a three foot tall dog. Uh, but there's two other guys who are disposing a big dead dog there, too. Uh huh. And they're just like, You need some help with that? I'm like, Yeah. <laughs> okay. It's kind right. of heavy. It's, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, so <laughs> they help me put Grimly. I'm like, You guys hit a dog, too? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, texting and driving. You know, one of the best uh, dumpsters in town. This was yeah, great. Yeah. yeah. We open it up. There's like six <laughs> other dead dogs in there. <laughs> it's like, Wow, I didn't know. They have you have no like you, you can't do a thing. They just run out sometimes. They run out. Yeah, it yeah. ran out. It's an Apple Valley problem. Yeah. yeah. Do you have do you have any tips on like getting dead dog smell out of your car? Yeah. Uh, you got to go to Lowe's. Okay. They have this thing called like acid bleach. Okay. Uh, you got to bleach your car. Uh, bleach my. Okay. You got to bleach it, and then what you're gonna need to do is you're gonna have to repaint the fabric so it looked like it did before the bleach. Uh, all right. I'll just probably just throw this car away and take another one. Whoa. Whoa. Lowe's, you know, you, don't really car. Too good for Lowe's. Yeah. I mean, Lowe's is great. I. Yeah, okay. All right. Thank you, guys. No um, problem. All right, so I drive back over to the Applebee's. Yep. And I go in, and you're, like, midway through. Well, I guess, did you sit down with her, or are you, yeah. like, next to her? Yeah, problem is she has a date. <gasps> okay, so I sit. I come in, uh, and you're sitting with her and her date? <laughs> yes. <laughs> okay. Yeah, yeah. So I come in and I sit down with you, with you guys. <laughs> yeah. Oh hi. Uh, wh wh what's going on, Mrs. Lilith? So this is weird, Fiona. I, we, Mrs. Lilith was here. Uh huh. At this very Applebee's. Yeah. Uh, it turns out she was on a date, and so like I was just I wasn't gonna sit the date for too long, but uh, uh. Did you give me this? Yeah. Oh. Uh, oh. Uh, Mrs. Lilith. Hey. Uh, you're on a date. Actually, this date is over. The what? guy who gets up and walks away. Huh. Oh. <laughs> uh. <laughs> Ask me to pay for the check. See you later. <laughs> oh. oh, Mrs. Lilith, we're so sorry. We're so sorry, Mrs. Lilith. We're sorry we ruined your date. It's okay. He didn't think Dookie was their best album. And scene. <laughs> <laughs> okay, uh, Kyle, can you grab one of those papers? That's the end of Act One. Oh yeah. Now we have to do the the soft the soft tilt. tilt. So this, the tilt. This has been hard to keep track of. This is a weird yeah. one. Yeah, it's pretty crazy. Uh, so the tilt is uh, it sort of enhances and interacts with any scene you want it to, uh, but this version has the soft tilt. So in stories where people aren't dying left and right, the soft tilt uh, is maybe more appropriate. Uh, so what we do is we roll the dice. Everyone rolls the dice that they or die that they have in front of themselves. And then you, if if one color is lower than the other, you subtract it out of the higher color. Uh, in my case, I just have a lot of white. Uh, white five. Okay, mine's like a white thirteen. White seven. Okay. Black six. Okay, so it'll be myself and Damiani. And Damiani. So Damiani, uh, can you hand me the remaining dice there? All of not, them? Not yours. Oh, okay. There was a black one that's yours. Yes. Yeah, so go. just those. Uh, so now, Damiani, do you want to do the top category or the bottom category? I'll do the bottom. Okay. So just so we can see what we have to deal with here, we've got uh, one, two, 
no four, no threes. One, two, four, five, six. Uh, so top categories for one is quotable, two is violence, three is deception, four is truth, five is folly, six is sex. I feel bad for ones, so I'll do quotable. Okay. Oh, because we had no ones earlier? Because we had no ones earlier. Sure, sure. And this is fun. Quotable. This is like we just work that quote into our scenes. Yeah. Two, four, five, or six. Just want me to read all of them. Just want me to pick. Yeah, yeah. Give us those quotes. All right. So the quotes were, this ends tonight. Mm, nice. You're too late. Oh, great. I'm just not that into you. Mm. I swear to God, I have no idea what happened. <laughs> <laughs> I love you. And we can fix this. Okay. Oh, all very good. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And uh, one, two, four, five, six. I really like, I swear to God, I have no idea what yeah. happened. Yeah. <laughs> between that and six, you know what? We'll go four. I swear to God, I have no idea what happened. Okay. So, the quote that we can say as often as we like in act two is, I swear to God. I have no idea what happened. I have no idea what happened. <laughs> <laughs> and we will see that come to fruition right after this. Hello, welcome back to Act 2 of this high school fiasco not Elias Whipple. What the hell's going on? Uh, Elias and Fiona Apple uh, mm -hmm. have somehow found their way into Mrs. Lilith's apartment. Yep. Mm -hmm. uh, she has ordered a pizza for them, and they're just chilling out. Yeah. How old are juniors? <clears throat> I think I established that we were juniors. Oh, we're juniors? Uh, so then we're 16 to 17. Uh, basket Woof. case <laughs> is playing on the radio. Okay. Okay. Let's say we're seniors. <laughs> okay. <laughs> sure. Not on the radio, I guess. Yeah. Um. <clears throat> uh, so, Mrs. Lilith, you have a really nice apartment. Thank you. Um, hey, Excuse me. um, I, I don't want to pry. I noticed, um, the other day that you were, listen, <laughs> I have to do a little weed sometimes because you guys, oh, your kids, oh, no. drive, uh, Mrs. kids Lilith, drive me insane. And I, it just, I just saw you crying. It just mellows me out. Okay. I didn't it see. It takes me back to college. Hey, it's okay. It's legal. You know? We love weed. We, I've, I've definitely tried it. Yeah. Do you want some? Oh. Yeah. Yes. Uh, oh. Ooh, uh, okay, uh. Okay. It's the good stuff, kids. All right. Cool. Yeah, we know yeah, good stuff from bad stuff. Let's do the good stuff. That sounds good stuff. Uh. My my. <laughs> My bong is in the closet over there. Could you be a darling and grab it for me? Mm-hmm. So, uh, so Elias goes over to the bong closet. <laughs> uh, so rolls it open, and it's a sad closet. There's, like, two coats and a bong yeah. and a broom. And a shoebox at the bottom. Yep. But you don't open it, maybe. Did you find it? Yeah. Bring it out, please. Cool. Uh, you want the first hit? Yeah. Hey, Fiona? Uh-huh. You know what would be cool? Yeah. Is if you, like, made a video of this. Vi a video of it? Yeah, like, if you made a video of Mrs. Lilith handing a bong to me, like, that'd be a like it'd be cool. Oh, um, yeah. I, that that could get me in serious trouble. Oh, but we wouldn't, like... We wouldn't post it. No, I just kind of, like, want it for a keepsake. Oh. Uh, yeah. So is it cool, Mrs. Lilith? So we'd be best friends, like the trio of Green Day. Are they friends? <laughs> oh, they've stood oh, together honey. through the years. Oh, honey. Yeah. Aren't they like you can't, 50? You can't survive the different presidential administrations like Green Day has and not be best friends. Mm -hmm. I suppose. Here, okay, I'm recording. Uh, what, what pose should I do? I'm well, not, it's a video. You I'm can. Not up on what the kids are into. I like basically bong stuff. So, like, well, what. Oh, bong stuff? Yeah, like what we normally do when we're hitting bongs. Um, yeah, I'm good at bong stuff. <laughs> okay. 
Oh. Uh, you know what they used to say in college? Mm-hmm. Lilith, you really let it rip. That was a good Lilith rip. Is that? Yeah, we love letting it rip. Yeah, totally. Okay. And me? Hey, you you promise you won't upload that, right? Of course no, not. Okay, yeah, thanks. No. Yeah. <laughs> no, don't. Don't. Oh, I think you have to. That, honey, that is terrible. You have to tilt it. Oh. <laughs> good. Good. Let's go! Fiona, let's go! Wait, wait. Let's go! Oh, ah. okay. <laughs> he, just, he drops the bong and runs away. Uh, <laughs> uh, Fiona kind of hangs back. The door is locked. Oh. Uh, Mrs. Loth, the door's, the door's locked. Elias, you can't get out? No, I'm, the locks don't work. The locks don't work? No. Honey, we, we have a rule here over at Mistress Lilith's apartment. <laughs> did, did no you one gets to leave until Dookie is done. Is okay. The, is that the the C, the CD yes. that's on? We've still got a good I haven't seen a 15 CD minutes of Dookie. Okay. Okay. <clears throat> okay. Um <laughs> you haven't taken a hit yet. I think it's your turn. Oh, uh, actually I have to go Where's the bathroom? Uh, <clears throat> uh Put it away. Put it away. Uh, They're going to smell it. Hello? Uh, hi, yes, ma'am. Sorry to disturb you on this day, but uh, my name's Bill Snyder. I work uh, security over at the Chili's uh, <laughs> over <laughs> on uh, on uh, Venison Avenue, right on uh, Apple. Yes, I'm very familiar. Um, I believe you... This could seem odd, but I believe you were at the Applebee's last night, weren't you, ma'am? Yes, this is Pierre Establishment, correct? Correct, and... Uh, um. Uh, well, anyway, my bud, my friend Bud, who works security over at the Applebee, is letting me know that there's just two kids that were uh, trying to dispose of a dog in the dumpster back there, and he happened to notice them hanging out with yeah, you in the, in, 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 in the go restaurant. Did we tell him? And what last hey, night... I'm going to go to the bathroom. Uh, sir, sir, uh, they're, they're my students. They saw me at the Applebee's. Sir, it's, it's the hut. help us! Help us! Uh, help Elias! Us. Elias! Help us. Shush. What's... She stabs him. <laughs> <laughs> stabs who? She, uh, uh, Mrs. Mrs. Lillis stabs, stabs that security, the security guard. Oh, 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 but I uh, grimly was done. <laughs> put him in the bong closet. No, put him in the bong closet. Put him in the bong closet. Mrs. Lillis, me, put him in the bong closet. Kids, help! Takes out her phone and starts yeah, filming. Call the police. He's still, Mrs. Lillis. We got take him to the hospital. He's still. Mrs. Lillis, what are you doing, ma'am? Fiona quickly is like (laughs) Remember what I said We don't leave Until the dookie is done (laughs) And scene scene. (laughs) What (laughs) Alright So you got a black right Yeah where'd it end up Oh there it is In act two you keep the dice you are given uh, Jason Futz, what are you up to? Um, okay, so Jason decided to go with the Green Day Fraud hashtag, mm. uh, which did net him the Polyrath card that he wanted so desperately. However, he has since become an outcast at the school where Weezer is hated and Green Day is seen as the greatest <laughs> American band of all time. And so, um, how many followers does he have right now? His his followers got slashed pretty hard. Oh. He's, he's down 300k. Wow, just from just from that one hashtag. So he's at 700k, approximately, and uh, he has decided to conceal his identity as the school mascot, Green Day Gorilla. <laughs> 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 um, <laughs> And he's hanging out in the gym, and he noticed that that, that Whipple is there. Psst. So this is like Monday. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. What? What? Hey, uh, Whipple. Yeah. It's me. Shh. Don't. Hey, don't look at this direction. What? I got it. I got to Yeah. This is my. This is my disguise. You're a Green Day Gorilla. Yeah. I uh. How do you do that and the football games? They, uh, 
<laughs> they kicked me off the team. <gasps> and get this. They kicked me off the team while playing when September ends. No. Yep. Yeah. Because, because of the Instagram. Yeah. 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 Susan, Susan walks by and she goes, oh, Jason, there you are. Look, <clears throat> your follower count has dwindled significantly. Last I checked, you have fewer than me. So uh, I'm actually going to go with Jessica to the dance. Um, I think she's got a shot at King. I'll do Queen still. It'll be fine. Uh, so yeah, sorry, uh, you y- you dumped. Okay, bye. That's not. Hey, that's not Jason. Who are you? That's not Jason in there. Huh? That's hey, not uh, Jason. No, in there. everybody else. knows that he's hey. the mascot. <laughs> no, it's not. Everybody knows it's somebody it. else. Hey, uh, Susan. That uh, that's his voice. <laughs> I can tell that that's you, Jason. Take the head off. <laughs> everybody knows that you're the mascot now. Everybody knows it. Do the uh, Jessica tweeted about it. Do the breadsticks mean nothing to you? Huh? I told oh. you I can't eat that many breadsticks the right before does a the, dance. I won't fit into my dress. Does the uh, does the iconic Caesar dressing that they're famous for mean nothing to you? You know the Caesar dressing is my weakness. But look, you're tanking on social and I can't have that. I can't have it. Susan, it's just time for me to tell these people the truth, okay? Look, make believe it's better than anything Green Day's ever done. <sighs> Beverly Hills, that's a single. Jason, I can Jason, tell... I kind of want to not be friends with you anymore. All right. Yeah, listen, I can tell you're having you like mental why is issues this, right why, now. Why is this school so against opinions? Hmm? We're not against opinions. We just love Green Day, one of the best just, bands that Green ever existed. Green Day is okay. just really good, Jason. So, so, look, I'm leaving. Is it not an opinion to say... Green Day sucks? Huh? Is that not an opinion? Is that not allowed here? Yeah, it's like saying America sucks. I don't get it, dude. Maybe America sucks. Maybe Jason Futz is sick of America. Je- uh, Susan stops in her tracks and turns back around. You're sick of America, Jason? That's right. That's right. Jason, it's not a good idea. She's been mad ever since her dog ran away. He didn't run away. Run away. He was murdered, and I you can don't prove know it. That. You don't I know that. I can prove it. You don't know that. People have been angling for Grimly <laughs> for months now, ever since. That dog was YouTube gold. Susan, okay? we have more important problems to deal with. More important problems than the murder of Grimly? Yes, like myself. Okay? Jason, newsflash, you are not important. Not anymore. Not since your social tanked. Not since Grimly died. Not since you decided to hate Green Day and America and love Weezers, those commie bastards. <laughs> You're done. You are canceled. Canceled. She storms ha- off. Have has she even listened to Buddy Holly? <laughs> <laughs> and see. <laughs> 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 All right, Chris Townsend. We've got two white dice left yeah. and four black dice left, so things are gonna go okay, not great for us. Hmm. <laughs> Poor Jason. That's <laughs> <Sorry. sighs> All right, so we are in. Uh, we're in a. Uh, we're in home economics. Oh, and, nice uh, class. And it's home economics. Yeah, a bunch nice. of sending class in there. And uh, I actually happened to sit next to uh, uh, Elias in, oh, okay. in that class. Yeah. And, uh, you know, I'm just looking. And uh, we'll start with there. All and right. uh, th- we're actually uh, we're trying to uh, learn to uh, learning to balance checkbooks. So our t- teacher's like, you're going to learn something practical today. Yeah. In 2018? In 2018. Yeah. Heck yeah. Yeah. <laughs> hey, it was the only thing that they taught us in home ec. In the 90s, and it'll yeah. be the only thing they teach forever. Uh, Elias has a weird scar above his eyebrow now, by the way. All right, all right. Okay. Wait. Oh, what? <laughs> hey, Elias. Uh, yeah. What happened to you, man? You got the like little mark above your head. Just, I just had a Chris. I just had a weird week- weekend. A weird weekend. A weird weekend. Yeah. Want to talk about it? I mean, this. No. Bouncing, oh, I don't oh. know you, dude. Okay. We was like sat next to each other the whole year and stuff. You know. 
We shared like notes and stuff. Remember when we uh, had to learn about like the basics of like banking and stuff? Yeah, that was before you turned into a weird freak who takes off his normal clothes the first second he gets into school. Oh, I'm s sorry. It's like expressing myself. And I'm sorry that I'm trying to express concern for you. Just wanted to know what happened <laughs> to see if you're okay. But that that's cool. That's cool. Listen, you don't even you don't even want to know. You don't even want to know. <sighs> you know. Listen, I, I I know that you're. Listen, I've been, but behind the scenes in the yearbook committee, I've been trying to get you to be nominated or picked as our uh, trending gamer of the year. And uh, <laughs> oh. I've been following your YouTube videos for a long time, yeah. man. And uh, I think they're pretty good. Dude. And uh, I know everyone else wants to nominate Ninja for this for some reason. Uh, <laughs> especially especially Susan because she dumped Jason and now they're going out together. They're 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 a thing now, Ninja and Susan. <laughs> Ninja dumped his longtime girlfriend who he bought a house because, with. Because <laughs> Ninja because <laughs> <'cause, laughs> you married? Yeah, I thought <laughs> Ninja, Ninja dumped his <laughs> wife. Ninja did all that because Ninja read about our our school paper published a story about the de uh, the de the murder conspiracy disappearance the disappearance of Grimley and the murder conspiracy and Ninja yeah. was just so engrossed in that yeah. that he reached out to Susan mm -hmm. uh, on Instagram and uh, they just hit it off and stuff and like yeah. had the secret fair like I'm surprised all of you didn't know about this it was like it's all over the news and stuff I told and, you like, I had a busy weird weekend but yeah that's why <laughs> like you seem so out of it like yeah. this must have been a big deal man yeah it was it was. Is a big deal. <laughs> a little blood is coming out yeah, of yeah, this, this weird scar. Oh, that looks really ghastly, man. Like, you cut yourself. Like, how, like how'd you do that? The home Come ec on. teacher comes by and she goes, "Oh, Elias, you're bleeding. Did you know you can make a rudimentary poultice out of baking soda?" Rudimentary she, like, what? A yeah, poultice. What? She starts stirring things together and like takes a little like plastic spatula and just like smears a little on your thing that will harden into a sort of bandage it, it actually feels a lot better too i am so pleased to hear that thank you dear elias chris please don't distract your classmates <sighs> whatever yeah, chris was bullying me again chris no, was not christopher me. townsend <laughs> you go sit in the hall right now <laughs> you go sit in the hall i'm getting kind of tired we have talked you know about what? bullying Cool, Elias. Fine. You just want to be like that? Fine. You know, I'll never talk to you again. You know what? I don't care what you're doing this weekend. You know what? Maybe you were like getting high he's or something. Bullying me. He's and, bullying and, Christopher and, Townsend outside right now. Fine. Go to the principal's office. Oh, stupid You principal. were just going to sit in the hall. Now go to the principal's office. Good. Maybe like spell me and it'll be like a vacation. That would be a vacation for all of us, Mr. Townsend. And <laughs> scene. <laughs> <laughs> so in act two, you keep this. Yeah. Okay. Ninja is dating or Susan. <laughs> yes. <laughs> yeah. All right. Um, so Fiona, Fiona Appleday Billings, uh, the yearbook meeting uh, nice. has ended. Oh, okay. Uh, and she, but she's just like sitting in the yearbook room. They've decided to, because uh, Jason had dirt on us, but now his social credit has fallen so far oh. that no one cares. Yeah. So even if he was telling the truth, no one would listen. So, um, like, he's only got, like, 100K followers at this point. It's, like, yeah. It's long fast. <laughs> yeah, compared to everyone else in this school, it's yeah. trash. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> uh, which is insane. But uh, so I'm sitting there, and, and Fiona's actually kind of, like, just staring at the desk. Or she's staring at she's staring at a memorial page for Grimley that she's had to start making <laughs> for the yearbook, and she's kind of just like shaking and like <laughs> almost crying, but not because she just is so like dead inside. And and then Elias is is like kind of like skulking the hallway like a ghost. It's like after class, you know, mm -hmm. it's, it's like three ten. Uh, you stalk the hallways like a ghost, and you you happen to just like notice me because I go like. <laughs> And you like hear me and see me and come in. Hey, hey, Fiona. <gasps> oh, hey, Elias. Um, how are you? Uh, off. Then off. Yeah, I've. It's been a very. Um. So anyway, I, I was thinking, why do you have like plaster on your face? It's too. Uh, it's covering my scar. 
Oh, well, it's still like a... It happened like two days ago. It's probably not a scar yet, right? It's like a cut. It's like a nasty, like, cut. It'll be a, a pretty cool scar, though, I bet. Anyway. There's nothing about that night I want to remember. Me neither. Um, so, uh, anyway, uh, you know, you know, Sherry, Mary, uh, you know how Which she- Which ones? Well, Mary, book, my Sher friend- Your book, Sherry? Yeah, my friend, the, yeah, the good one. Okay. Not the mean one. I- I know her. Oh, right. Yeah. Uh, I meant Sherry then. Yeah. Um, also, she told us, and, like, it's okay. Like, if you like her, you know, maybe you should ask her out in real life. What do you mean, real life? Real fucking <laughs> life. Like, right now. Like this. Ask her to the dance. We have plans that night that are better than a freaking dance. What? Who? Me and Sherry. So you already asked her? No! What? We have... <sighs> They're called sex dates. And so... The, aren't basically, those just dates? You, you schedule rooms within the VR realm. <laughs> Okay. There's basically, there's a schedule. You have to plan it out like weeks ahead of time. Look. And so Sherry and I have a, a room locked in. Oh, okay. Well, I guess I knew she wasn't going to the dance, so I, I'm glad she has something to do. Anyway, if you like her, though, you could probably ask her out and... <gasps> See you tonight, Sonic. <laughs> was that... Yeah, it was Sherry, obviously. Oh. Uh, well, anyway... We both be... We both... We're both Sonic. <laughs> <laughs> Well, naturally. <laughs> uh, anyway, <laughs> my other friend who's like the computer science has, yeah, yeah she yeah. helped me so that <laughs> I rigged it up so that if there's a notice of anything, like if, if either of us like uh, dies or something, yeah. the, the video that I got of Mrs. Lilith killing that no, man no you will, said you would delete go it live. you said you would delete no, it no you it's, said you've it's said called, shh, you said elias elias it's called it's called insurance elias <sighs> it's an insurance policy so we don't die so we have to i don't ever really want to see her again even though uh we had class with her this morning and that was very odd mm -hmm. we need to confront her and tell her that if she doesn't give us what we want the video will go live and I think she should uh, give us A's in the class. And also, because that bitch Susan is going to milk her dog's death for all kinds of essays, uh, she's got to give her a B minus. Mm -hmm. On all of them. B minus. Um, just then, uh, there's a fire drill. The, uh, uh, wait, it's after school. Yeah, yeah. They can still they, be they fire do a alarm fire, a fire yeah. alarm goes off. It's yeah. not a drill. Yeah. And, um, and... Uh, we go, uh, everyone goes, files outside, and like a lot of the students had gone home. Um, and we are, uh, so the, the fire department is coming, and we are um, uh, arriving at, or, or we're, they're arriving, and we're outside, and uh, we happen to be standing next to Mrs. Lilith. Uh, and, and we're, the three of us are just sort of like silently standing there as, as the fire department comes. Uh, she is. She's usually very rigid. She is very slacked and smoking a cigarette. Um, <clears throat> and uh, and as the longer we stand there, the more we realize, like, like we all just assumed it was a drill because it always is. Mm -hmm. um, but we realize that the the western eastern wing of the school, where Mrs. Lilith's class is, smoke is starting to come out of the side of the school, and then uh, and like we hear one of the fire firemen goes by and, and we hear the word structure um, as they're going by and then like we just kind of like both look at Mrs. Lilith and she just takes a long drag off her cigarette scene. Ooh. <laughs> <Don't> okay. <laughs> Alright. <laughs> Alright. Elias Whipple. Uh... Elias is being interrogated <laughs> for arson. Uh, uh, so it's in the it's in basically the town hires the Applebee security uh, <laughs> to do any investigations. They're elite. They're very good. Yeah, force. Yes. Yeah. Uh, so there's two Applebee security guards uh, behind a table uh, talking to Elias uh, about the fire. 
All right, kid. When was the last time you were at Applebee's? Uh, I, I guess we go like three times a week, so I guess like Thursday. What's your favorite thing on the menu? The chicken tenders. The chick we know you're lying, you little <laughs> trash. We know you're lying. You didn't order no chicken tender. God damn it. Well, I didn't say I ordered every time. I didn't say I ordered every time. Did you instead perhaps order the fajitas? You answer the truth. You yeah, tell him. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. So your favorite is the chicken tenders, but, but you I ordered order the fajitas. chicken fajitas. Yeah, because we go there three times a week. I didn't want to order the same thing every day. And you're a young, impressionable kid. Yeah. They bring out those fajitas uh -huh. on that sizzling plate. Yeah. And they give you an idea. Hmm? You saw those green peppers a-cooking and a-popping. Yeah. And you said, hey. You thought I might make a fajita of my own. Get classes canceled for a couple of days. Huh? 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 Wait, I'm in here for the for the fire? You think I did the fire? Well, well, yeah! Well, you're here for that, and we also have a 20% off coupon, but we'll get to that in just a second. Because if you go three times a week, you're a very important member. Right, we value you. Yeah. Five stars on Yelp. Yeah, but you only get that after you ace this little interrogation. My dad's going to be super proud, by the way. Good. Did you Your burn it down or not, like you smart little man. fajita no, eating no, snot? No, I swear oh. to God, I had no idea what happened. Well, then who burned it down? Yeah, give us some information. You want 20% off or not, huh? Huh? Maybe we'll bump it to 25 if you're nice. Yeah, your parents will finally be proud of no, you. No, I don't know. I don't know what kind of person would light Mrs. Lilith's room on fire. Uh, so at Applebee's, we're doing a new initiative where uh, we do some background checks on our guests so we can better <laughs> serve them. Uh, we happen to find out about your favorite activity there, Sonic. <gasps> That's and right. we saw that uh, in the virtual world, you do not eat at Applebee's. Well, no. You eat at Rattlers. Yeah. And there's a virtual Applebee's right across the street from Rattlers. Sonic loves chili dogs. It <laughs> the door, the door Wait of the interrogation room opens and a, a sizzling fajita plate comes in. Two, <laughs> two sizzling fajita plates come in and they set them down in front of the security guards who, who sit down and start eating. <laughs> Wouldn't you like one of these sizzling fajita plates, son. Hey, now listen, Jim. Listen, Jim. Huh? You're telling me in the virtual wor world Yeah. you eat at Rattlers yeah. for canonical reasons. Yes. I think we got to respect I that, I think Jim. I respect that, actually. <laughs> I did. Hey, Vinny. Bring him in a plate. Bring him in a plate. They bring in a sizzling fajita plate, <gasps> but no silverware. <gasps> now you'll get a fork if you answer our next question. Better go fast. Correctly. A security guard has gone missing. One of the elite. One of the elite four here at Applebee's. <laughs> he is missing. Where's Lance? Where is he? Why would I? I know you know, you little shitbag. Well, you want I a know. fork or not? I, I've never. Why would I? Why would I? No, I just. You're acting real squirrely, son. Can you... Damn, this fajita's good. Can you? Can We've you, got the power to cancel your little sex party. Can you promise you would protect me? Yes, of course. We're the Applebee's security elite. Please. <laughs> I've... What did you see, boy? I can see it in your eyes. What did you see? What did you see? What did you see? Miss, Mrs. Lilith killed him. Vince, give yeah. this kid a fork. Bumping that off to 30%. He just knocked on the door. He was being nice. He was just there to ask... If we wanted any coupons or something. Damn it, Lance! Oh, he's too ambitious. He's too then, ambitious. I knew. I told him not to follow up that dead dog thing. And here he go and got his snout in a murder arson combo. And then Mrs. Lilith, she stabbed him. She broke her bong, and then she stabbed him with a the bong. Blood. You say drug use and murder and arson. Yeah. You know, not this only is that. all three: narco, arson, and homicide. <laughs> this is the big one. Last we week, made it. Last week. This just seals the case. Last week. We caught Mrs. Lilith bagging some fries. And now we've got her. We've don't, got her. Don't, no one steals from us. Don't let her know that I... Don't let her know that you said you would protect me. Son, you're safe with us. This is Applebee's. Phew. No also, one will ever hear hide nor hair of this. There'll be some uh, special presents at your little party tonight. Enjoy. <laughs> okay. Hey, hmm. the 30% only lasts for a week. You okay. better get in there, okay? Make sure yeah. you use it. Tell your parents. Oh, bring we'll them. Bring go, them in. We'll probably go tomorrow night. Okay. Wait. What? The dance is tonight, 
and you're mm -hmm. yeah okay yeah. good well don't miss the dance that's a big that's big for kids right you like the I have a sex date um, ah hey uh <laughs> on your way out yeah get Mrs Lilith in here we have a few questions she's here in the building why would you bring her here also wait if we have her sent if we have him send her in she gonna know the kid squawked we're the Applebee's elite we're better than that. It doesn't matter. She can know whatever she wants, but once you deal with the Applebee's elite... Right, we're gonna kill her, that's We're gonna true. kill her. Yeah. She's going right in the dirt. Scene? Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I guess it's a white for me? Wow. Yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Alright. I'll take Whoa, it. Whoa, sorry. <laughs> we're gonna kill her. She's going right in the dirt. <laughs> Put her in the Chili's dumpster. <laughs> that's what I, was thinking. I was thinking in the Chili's lawn, but dumpsters is better. Uh... Who the hell scene was that? That, that was, was mine. Okay. <laughs> so Jason Futz final scene what you, of of you. Uh so Jason Futz um goes to the Olive Garden by himself. Okay. Uh, was not able to Oh, but he did he got a reservation. Right. He got a reservation. Yeah, so he was yeah. honoring the reservation. But did not secure yeah. another date. Right. Doesn't yeah. have anybody else to go with, so he's going just by himself. Yeah. Hey waiter. Yeah. Uh, can I get another Coke Zero, please? <laughs> yeah. Sure. Thanks, babe. Should we tell him it's just normal Diet Coke? Nah. He looks like he's having a bad. Night. He's had a bad week. If you, oh, have you looked at his followers lately? Oh shit. Yeah. Look. Hmm. Give him some extra breadsticks, huh? Yeah, I, yeah. I definitely. Yeah, poor yeah, 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 poor kid. Also, isn't that dance tonight? I thought all the high schoolers were all dressed up. Well, he is too. Presumably, he's gonna try to go. Hey, uh, waiter. Oh uh, yes, yeah. Hey, come here a second. Okay. okay. <laughs> Do you know there was a poker stop right here? Yeah, a couple of summers ago, we were very popular. <laughs> 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 you like uh, you like the mon? Yeah, I like the mon. You like the mon, huh? Yeah. Yeah, why don't you sit down? We'll we'll talk about it. Oh, you know, I got some other tables to take care of. I hey, let me get. Hmm? I come from a rich family. I'll uh, pay away, babe. How many times do you get to talk about the mon? <laughs> I don't. With the futz himself. I, I don't typically, Mister Futz. I don't typically talk about the mon too much. I I do. I have obligations. I'm sorry, I, I must serve the other tables. Before you go, if you want a good tip, hmm. all right, you're gonna hear me out. All right, since we can't talk about the mon, you can at least hear something about me if you want a good tip, okay? Sure. I, uh, I've lost 900,000 followers in two days. <laughs> yeah, we, we know. Yeah. <laughs> we yeah. know. Yeah. And uh, to tell you the truth, I've never felt better. I could say uh, Green Day sucks. I don't have to look over okay. my shoulder anymore. Hey, please hey, don't say that out loud tip. here. Please. The restaurant goes I'm, like quiet. Yeah. I'm thinking 40% here. You want to hear this or not? You want to get that tip? No, we don't allow this kind of language here at Olive Garden. We're family. <laughs> I can say how much I like the album Hurley. I could say... The manager walks up. <laughs> uh, excuse me. Uh, oh, were you the manager? No. Oh, you can be the manager. I was gonna do something else. Oh, okay. The manager walks up and says, yeah. uh, excuse me, uh, can you keep it down, please, sir? This is a family establishment. Sir, I've been keeping it down my whole life. Um, sorry to interrupt. I couldn't over help but overhearing. You're talking about Green Day, weren't you? Yeah, they, uh, they're washed up. <gasps> They're washed up. <sighs> you should go. We're sorry. We're no, sorry. No, 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 no. Hang on. I got this. <clears throat> so, uh, <laughs> you might have heard of me, but uh, my name. Let me introduce myself. My name's Ninja. Oh. <laughs> I'm in town because I was supposed to go to this dance tonight <laughs> with this girl named Susan. And, you're uh, going with my girl? Oh, she's your girl. And you're the well, second best Fortnite player. And well, you're going with my girl. <laughs> well, we're not going anymore because uh, she just. I was really feeling about Grimly, and uh, <laughs> she seemed to have been gotten over it a little too fast for my liking, and uh, <laughs> just not working out. But uh, anyway, that's not important right now. Um, I heard about your plight about Green Day, and I just want to say, as a fellow Green Day hater, <gasps> okay, 
Okay, right, why don't uh, you two go? Gamma, both hey, of you. Me. Hey, Ninja, you Ninja, go? Ninja. Why don't you go over to Chili's where they don't care about Green Day either? We're better off, and I hear you can get two for 20 at Chili's. Oh, really? Cut two, they're at Chili's. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> they're just at a table with Chili's, just and, having a bunch and of. And through the window in the background, you just see some guys dumping a dog <laughs> into the dumpster. Yeah. Yep. So, uh, Ninja. <laughs> yeah. I got an idea. Lay it on me. <laughs> you don't like Green Day? That is correct. You and I both like this chili con queso. <laughs> Pretty good. And uh, we are both uh, Twitch Titans, yeah? Yeah, I'm a I'm pretty big Titan, but uh, I was kind of like looking you up while we're sitting here. And uh, <laughs> hey, I noticed you're kind of on a downward trend. We all have dips, Ninja. Okay. <laughs> we all have dips. That's, I understand your plight, too. Just hear me out. All right. Uh, as a fellow Green Day hater, I want to do you a solid. I heard, I, I feel bad. I didn't know Susan was your girl and stuff like that. Um, I just felt bad about her, her dog and stuff. I was just trying to do a nice thing. It was kind of, actually it was a publicity stunt. My agent had me do it and yeah. stuff. And uh, <laughs> just, I just didn't like where it was going and stuff. But like, I actually, I actually feel bad for you. And uh, I want to make it up to you. I want to do, I want to take a selfie for us to post on my Instagram. And uh, we're going to, we're going to tag Chili's. We're going to tag hating green day and uh we're gonna tag you in it and i think it's gonna turn things around for you i think this is what you need right as, now as he's talking the the light of the sun coming through the windows is blotted out by the arrival in the parking lot of a giant tour bus <laughs> um and moments later green day walks into the chilies and each of them has a puppy dog with them that is the same breed as grimly mm. and they all sit down at a table and uh, they're talking about how they're playing the dance tonight, and they're they're gonna present the dog these dogs to that girl whose dog got murdered. Sha 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 yeah yeah yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, and they're they're like ha hanging out, and like everyone's like, oh my god, it's Green Day. Yeah. <laughs> hey uh hey ninja. Uh yeah what's up? You believe in fate? <laughs> <laughs> uh have an open mind. <laughs> yeah what well, sure. Give it a white yeah. back. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> We're going to do everything you just said, buddy old pal. But we're going to do it while we're flipping off Green Day. <laughs> oh, yeah, that's, that's Green Day over there, isn't yeah. it? Yeah. I can smell them from here. Yeah, what are they doing here? Smells like dookie to me. Yeah, let's do this. You know, I like I, I like the cut of your jib. Let's do this. Let's do this. <laughs> In scene. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Chris Townsend, what are you, what are you doing? All right, so I'm uh, at school. I'm in the I'm in the library. Uh, in between, uh, it shouldn't be in the library right now. I'm on the computer and I'm trying to hash it out with eBay customer support right now because uh, the credit card payment for the polygraph. Uh, got declined, and the seller is like livid and stuff. Yeah. And it's saying, I, 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 as the buyer, I have now frauded them. They want the card back. Okay. Uh, <laughs> and I, I'm on the, I'm on, I, I, I get, I'm on there, and uh, I shouldn't be there. So it's kind of like doing the kids wouldn't do, they wouldn't be doing a phone or anything. They'd be doing the, the chat on the computer, like the, the text chat. I've heard of it. I've so, heard of yeah, that. Yeah. It's so just like, oh my. All right, do you not understand? It was my dad's credit card. He paid for it and stuff. It's not my fault that it expired or whatever. Just get the new stupid number. I don't know. I just, can't you just look it up, stupid rep? <laughs> there. Any response? Um, we at eBay are not at liberty to uh, just transmit uh, one sale from one credit card to another credit card, even if it is saved on the account without the primary user's authorization. So uh, we will need to speak with your father, preferably over the no, phone. No, 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 you cannot, you can't do that. I'm in so much trouble right now. No. Mary He's, scoots over. Uh, Hello, Chris. Uh, hi, Mary. Uh, close the screen. What's up? Couldn't help but notice that you're in a little bit of a financial bind. Um, what are you talking about? I'm here to offer you a proposition. 
A proposition for what? Yes. What do you even know? I'll take care of this eBay business for you. But okay. But you will, for me, have to go to the after-school Christian program, write my name down. <laughs> That's part one. <laughs> part two is you will have to take a picture of you and me, send it to my dad, and say we're boyfriend and girlfriend. Or there's another thing you could do that I think you'll want to do even less. <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> you can take me to next year's prom, and then and then maybe like after high school we get married. <laughs> you're, you're, well, you're kind of crazy with that. I'm not what. Like you want to get married? Yeah. Good luck on eBay then. If I'm crazy. But the first option. What? Yeah. You want me to go sign in for you? This yes. was my idea. Did you overhear me? This no. was my idea. This originally. is my idea. I no, had this, this first. Was my no, this idea. Was my idea. No, I had this months ago. I had this a year ago. Okay, a year ago. <laughs> mm-hmm. So you want me to do that? And then yes. why do you want your dad to think we're boyfriend girlfriend? Because he's. he's well, like, what's the deal? He there? says I'm doing too much stuff VR, and I tell him they're genuine. Wait a second. Genuine sexual experiences, but he doesn't wait, think wait, it's hold real the life. Phone. What? You do VR too? Yes. VR does VR chat room stuff. Yeah. But you do sex rooms? Of course. Like what kind? <laughs> Sonic the Hedgehog. You do Sonic the Hedgehog? Yeah. Okay. Um. So you're a furry. I guess you could say I'm in that that classification of such. Yes. So, but you only do VR. Yeah. I I go to furry cons in person. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Oh no. <laughs> we only have black. I forgot we only have black. <laughs> I want a success for yeah, this yeah. so much. So, how would you like to go with me to a to, to the furry con? Uh, I don't think so. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> Screen back on. Yeah, I'll be back eBay. to eBay and see. <laughs> <laughs> okay uh all right well i feel like it's all been leading up to the dance oh sure so it's the dance mm-hmm. um fiona apple day billings uh is there by herself and um sherry i'm good i'm confused which one's which sherry my friend sherry is not the sex chat room one she's the hacker they who actually likes- both were okay 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 Mary has the wheelchair and likes fashion, but is secretly a computer whiz. Mm-hmm. Okay, cool. So Sherry has the date with Elias, right? In the VR sex room? I think it might be Mary, actually. Okay. Sure. They're both not here. Yes, <laughs> okay. okay. Um, and Jason Futz, you weren't going to go, right? Jason Futz... He's with Ninja. Yeah. Right. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Jason Futz and Ninja are enacting some kind of plan against Green Day. Yes. They're so, moving off Green Day for an Instagram photo. Oh, yeah, right. At the dance. No, at oh, the... at the uh, Chili's. Chili's. Okay, yeah. okay. In fact, Green Day is late for some reason. Nobody knows why. <laughs> Nobody knows why. <laughs> yeah. Um, okay, yeah. So everyone's kind of milling around yeah. and waiting for Green Day to show up. <laughs> uh, cool Susan is there, and she's, like, looking all pretty. Um, and... She's after, with Jessica. Yeah, she's with Jessica because yeah. after she ditched Jessica for Ninja and then Ninja ditched her, she went back with Jessica. Mm-hmm. Um, so they're hanging out and dancing, or like dancing to like the DJ music that's just on. Yeah. And uh, which is also Green it's Day. Screen Day. Yeah. And uh, on my own, here we go. And there's people just <laughs> yeah. grinding on each other. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> on my own, here we go. <laughs> and uh, Miss, Miss Lilith is at the school and um, uh, Fiona Appleday Billings is like watching her from across the way. And uh, the um, so the this goes on for a little while. And uh, Chris, are you at the dance or no? Um, I mean, I can be, but uh, I think way, my, I would have been like principal's office twice. I think I might have oh, been yeah. expelled. Oh yeah, yeah, not allowed. You know to go what? To the I'm da- rebelling. I just, show up anyway. Okay, yeah. okay. I show you up, show up anyway. anyway. And uh, Mrs. Lilith, who's supposed to Miss Lilith, who's supposed to be chaperoning, she doesn't seem to care about anything She's anymore. She's still smoking. Yeah. yeah, still smoking inside. The same cigarette. <laughs> The principal came over to tell him off, but he's kind of like a mousy guy, and she just like looked at him, and he's like, oh, okay, okay. Um, so this goes on for a little while. Green Day's not showing up, and no one knows what's happening. Uh, and then all of a sudden, the skylights of the uh, auditorium open all at the same time, and everyone's like, what is that? What is that? And we, yeah, we hear like strange like footsteps on the ceiling, and then four, three, three men uh, in black full black suits 
with a little red apple on the back, uh, rappel down from ropes into the gym and w- approach Miss Lilith <laughs> and, uh, and say, Miss Lilith, by the authority vested in us by Applebee's, you are under arrest for the murder of Lucas, was it? Uh, Bill Snyder. Lance. 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 For the murder of Lance, uh, for uh, committing arson against the school, and uh, for general uh, drug use. Um, And please come with us right now. On my own, here I go. Bold words. Bold words. Take me away, boys. Uh, They handcuff her with a zip tie. Okay. They put a a belt around her her waist, slap a carabiner on the front of it, and then go like that. Wait, wait, wait. (gasps) Before you do this, you have some standards, right? Yes. Yes. If somebody says wait, we must stop. We have the highest of standards. We are Applebee's Elite 3. Then you know. Applebee's Elite, it'd be a shame to leave an Applebee's catered event without getting some of those finger-licking ribs. It's part of our code. She does have a good point. Because I'm not coming back from this. I will go and prepare you a plate. Mm -hmm. (laughs) Go over to Applebee's. You have the right to remain silent and get some ribs. (laughs) (laughs) I bring her a full plate of, like, the spread, you know? Yeah. All right. um, Sir. My hands are tied. You're going to have to feed me the ribs. Um, all, all right. Uh, here we go. Mm. <sighs> yeah, enjoy these. These yeah. are going to be your these. last ribs. These are your last oh, ribs you ever see. You crazy lady. Oh, boy. Okay. We loved Lance. We loved him. He's like a brother to me. A literal bro- brother. My literal yeah. brother. Yeah. And he's dead now, so. Where are you taking me? Applebee's jail 500 feet above the earth's surface <laughs> I'm ready <laughs> the, the cord <laughs> yeah, yeah and we all like lift up out of the thing and all the kids are like what just happened what? and then uh, uh, everyone is like confused and there's like kind of like pandemonium breaking out because Green Day's not here yeah and, and uh, they thought that was Green Day they saw three yeah they thought it was suits. Green Day yeah yeah, yeah. yeah. They thought, and now everyone yeah. is like Intro. and like the tension in the room is is like palpable, mm-hmm. um, and so Fiona is thinking, and she goes, "Everyone." Uh, she she gets up onto the um, the, the the stage, and, and Fiona goes, <clears throat> "Excuse me, everyone, everyone, everyone. We want Green Day. Green we Day. Green Day. Green Day. Green Day. Green Day. Green Day." Green Day should be coming, um, but I know uh, this is not exactly the traditional order for things, but, um, uh, you know, a- 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 after the dance, we usually announce the the categories and the winners for the yearbook, and, um, well, since the other two, uh, the other three members of the of the yearbook committee, I don't, they don't seem to be here, uh, and Chris wasn't allowed to come. Chris raises his hand. Oh. And a spotlight shines on him. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Chris, you're here. Um, well, come come up. Um, I, I can... We can <laughs> we can announce the winners now. Uh, yeah, I guess we can do that. Before yeah. I get hauled out of here. You know, it's the yeah. least I can do. Yeah. Um, I actually... I have the... We prepared a video uh, <laughs> for, for this so that we don't actually just sit here and read them off. There's a video that shows them all. Um, so I, I have this video. We want Green Day. Hey, hey we Green want Day's Green coming. Day. Green yeah, Day's coming. Down. Uh, Mary was supposed to help me with the, the video, but um, so I hopefully I do this right. Should beam here, and so she tries to beam the yearbook video. Hey uh, everybody! I heard Green Day's at the Chili's. Let's get out of here. <laughs> 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 A stampede! <laughs> A stampede! Everybody runs out of that room. Everybody leaves, and then I hit play, <laughs> and it's the video of Miss Lilith killing the security guard that plays accidentally, and I just go, "Well, it's a good thing nobody's in here anymore." Wow, Mrs. Lilith killed a security guard. Yeah. <laughs> when did this? That happened on Friday night. Elias and I witnessed it. She made us do drugs, too. Oh, that's what happened with Elias. That's why he didn't want to talk about it. 
<laughs> yeah. Why do you both do such cool shit and never invite me? We don't like you. Oh. <laughs> the end. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, poor Chris Townsend! <laughs> <laughs> we don't like you. We don't like you. Okay. <laughs> uh, you roll again now for your epilogue. Roll lives. your dice, yep. And then you subtract whichever number is higher out of whichever number is lower. Oh, Damiani got all black die, huh? Yeah, Damiani's gonna do okay. Uh, okay, so, uh, what is that? Seven? Alright, uh, Kyle! Yep. What did Elias get? White five. Okay. Let me see. We're going to use the soft aftermath. Soft. Uh, okay. What? What? Five. Desperate. Still looking for an angle. Still rearranging the desk, the deck chairs, whatever that means. Stuck in a holding pattern, getting nowhere. <laughs> so, uh... Elias, you know, feels comfortable... Uh, spending his Friday night, he knows that Mrs. Lilith can't attack him, mm -hmm. uh, and so you know he's he's uh, in the lobby for his sex date. Uh, <laughs> but uh, in comes uh, not a or not a Sonic. It's like um, it's like a, I don't know. It's like a it's like a woolly mammoth. It's just like a woolly <laughs> mammoth walks into the sex room, and he's like, "Who are you?" And the woolly mammoth says, We have VR in jail. That's terrifying. Yeah. <laughs> the end. Nice. Uh, ben, what did Jason Futz get? White one. Whoa, oh, boy. No. White one. Astonishing. People. Oh, it's good? Uh, no, astonishing. Well, astonishing is 11 plus too, so I think this is bad astonishing. Uh oh. Astonishing. People didn't think it was even possible to be as reviled as you are, oh, no. but you proved them wrong. <laughs> You'll wear the world's contempt for the rest of your life. Are you in jail, protective custody, or a disguise? Probably. If Is your life and the lives of those you care about most completely ruined? Definitely. <laughs> Um, so the Instagram post yeah, yeah. <laughs> where, uh, him and Ninja flip off, uh, Green Day yeah. is so reviled yeah. and so, like, just, it just, it incenses the whole town. And, uh, before the kids even come to the Chili's, uh, to, from the dance, they find out about this post on their yeah. phones. Um, and they, they take... They take Jason uh, out into the alleyway behind the Chili's, uh, and for some reason they have uh, a hot iron, and they brand the Weezer W on his on his on his on his, <laughs> on his forehead. Oh my God! And uh, this is a a hated symbol in the town, and so he has to leave his home. Lord. And uh, the best that he can do is he has to move to Canada, where he still has some semblance of, Toronto. of, of yeah of, of a fan base there, and he becomes a manager at a Target. <laughs> hey, come up and nice. love it. No, he hates it. Oh, oh no, I know. Yeah, but well, that's what you were making fun of him for. Yeah, I love it. Right, right. Uh, okay, Chris Townsend, what uh, what what'd you get? Black five. You made me do math, Damiani. Uh, inspirational, as in, isn't it inspirational how that poor child managed to claw her way out of that hideous rat hole of a life? And isn't right. she just a little trooper? Yeah, okay. <laughs> Alright, so, <laughs> as it goes, uh, Chris had second thoughts about Mary's proposal, realizing that, uh, <laughs> you know, he kind of got a dose of his own medicine yep. and learned how, uh, just like, it's you need to stop blaming the world for his problems. He was the source of his problems. Whoa, and whoa. he was going to have to take to take action to get out of this. So he accepted the first proposal from Mary. Um, so he didn't quite get out of... He, not her proposal for marriage. Right. Not the proposal for marriage. Uh, had to travel to uh, Apple Valley uh, after school, Jesus Fellowship, every single day to mm -hmm. sign in. Yep. Uh, but didn't have to stay there. That was the thing. Wanted to get out of it, but you know, still signing in. So it's a compromise there. 
took the photo, sent it to the dad mm-hmm. of them going in a relationship. Yeah. Took care of that eBay problem. Yeah. Um, and so father never found out about it and stuff. It was paid off and everything like that. Just another, like, you know, charge on the rich dad's account. You know, didn't, you know. Yeah. What's another $4.50? Yeah. What's another $4.50? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, was, yeah four, like $4.50 for that uh, Polyrath card. Yeah. Um, but, uh, yeah, he, uh, he found out that, uh, you know, he needed to uh, he needed to branch out, and so he decided to stop going to furry cons and started to embrace the the, the VR the VR chat room stuff, <laughs> as Mary suggested. So he went in there and uh, he found uh, he found a group for um, he found a group for uh, people who love uh, crap. <laughs> Uh, crap. Forgot. What? Care Bears. No, 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 not Care Bears. Um, Pony. plushies. Jesus, oh, okay. plushies. I was going to call them dolls, but I was like, no, it's not dolls. For plushies. Like mm-hmm. Beanie Babies? Um, like Beanie Babies will like count and stuff animals? like stuffed sure, animals, stuffed stuff animals, yeah, stuff like yeah, that. Yeah, yeah. It's a thing. Um, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's, like, it's like collectibles. Like, <laughs> yeah. yeah, just like, you know, stuff like that. Yeah. Um, and they like to, because you can't meet in person with your, uh, your, your, your little, like, plushie like that. It would be a little too awkward. Socially not acceptable and stuff. But VR allows that to happen for him. So he gets to meet other people who love to, you know, just hold their little cute plushies together. And then just interact and stuff. It's kind of a comfort object. And, uh... You know, he spends most of his time there now, oh. and it's his outlet. Nice. That's nice. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Poor Chris. Uh, I got a white six. Uh, sad. Woeful. Not cool. People don't like you. Even you don't like you. You reached your peak, and it wasn't all that lofty, was it? Uh, jeez. So, um, yeah, Fiona was never popular, and still is not popular and has become even more like withdrawn and um uh introverted Uh, basically almost has like ptsd from like witnessing a murder and uh yeah while trying to seduce a teacher and so she kind of just like does her class stuff her grades have kind of fallen she gets b's all the time now which is really upsetting she she's like she's really mad at herself about it and her parents are like her parents actually are trying, they're like very loving and trying to be very supportive. Um, and they just can't reach her really. She's just kind of sad about everything and just kind of withdrawn. And uh, she's kind of pinning most of her hopes on maybe like getting out of town and going to college. Uh, Susan now has four dogs uh, that Green Day brought her. Um, <laughs> and like, she's like friends with Green Day now. Yeah. And so, like, there's like some jealousy there. For sure. No one ever found out that, that Fiona f- killed the dog or anything. Uh, so, yeah, everything's just kind of like sucky. Uh, and life goes on. Yeah. That's so, a sad ending for everybody. This yeah. Week. So that's fiasco nods. <laughs> like, I'm kind of sad Chris is just like, nah, I'm never going to a furry convention again. Yeah. You could do both. I guess he just loves stuffed animals. He loves stuffed animals. Like he didn't love being a stuffed animal. Like he just didn't have it. He didn't have it targeted the right way. Right. And then so VR opened up all these alternate doors. A refined experience. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. So it's a good ending, yeah, kind okay. of. Yeah. All right. Um. <laughs> Anyone on to become a superstar Fortnite player? Oh, okay. Great. No. Oh, sure. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. You didn't roll that high because Ninja yeah. Ninja was done after he said Green Day sucks. Yeah. And tank, so tank it left too. his whole door yeah. open. Yeah. yeah. Um, <laughs> all right. Well, that is Fiasco Nuts again. Fiasco Nuts g- goes adult, goes off the rails. We meant no offense to uh, Weezer fans, Green Day fans, Ninja, Furries, Christians, non Christians, high schoolers, teachers, uh, Applebee's, Chili's, Olive Garden, um, oh, fans. Polyrath fans, mm. uh, jocks, non-jocks, cringers, cringers, uh, uh, non-cringers, dog lovers, mm-hmm. humanity, humanity, uh, Elon Musk, <laughs> maybe a little bit. Uh, all right. Oh yeah, I'm an offense made to Chili's. Sure. Get your shit together. Get chilies. offended, Chili's. Yeah. All right. <laughs> oh, I forgot. To work in the scary old man from Mulholland Drive that's always behind the dumpsters. I had an idea, but, but never mind. Uh, all right. <laughs> we are easy allies. It would have been good. It would have been great. It would have been good. It would have been good. 
We're easy allies. Thank you for whatever the hell this was. Uh, join us again at the end of next month for another zany fiasco nuts. Whoa, Christmas. We're gonna have to schedule that one. Uh, okay. Anyway, easyallies.com slash dot com. Uh, patreon.com slash easyallies. Twitch. Dot tv slash ninja. Dot tv slash... Bye!